Hey, that was a positive way to start it off. Yeah, I like that. I like that. That was that. a dope vibe. Uh, Chica, Crown, super tough track. It is. Um, I have not heard that in so long. Yeah. <laughs> like, you, like, that brought, like, so much random It's like life. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like it makes you think about it. <clears throat> yeah, definitely. A positive aspect on, on music. So, but uh, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> back hola, to the hola, podcast, hola. you feel me? Mm-hmm. Everything good? We good? We live? We straight? Yep. Hey. Audio's great. We're Sounding great. good. All right. Yeah. Even Nisha got a mic still. Our boy Steve is back, man. Yeah, man. Everybody, round of applause for Steve being back. You know what I'm hey, saying? Man, we are glad you're back, man. You know, you've been busy. Life has been lifing, as Ooh. it always is. Life has been lifing, How you my been, boy. Man? I have been tired, okay? <laughs> work, school, work, school, family. kids, family, Yo. Mm-hmm. videos. Hey. Hey. We life. making it. It's real. We life. making it happen, okay? No, we are, man. Glad to have you back, though, man. <laughs> oh, for sure. Um, Glad to be back. We was in the pod so deep one time, we forgot to mention that you weren't here. We were like, God. <laughs> Steve not here, man. Mm-hmm. I mean, something was missing. <laughs> we did. But we was going in about something uh, one of them pods ago. So it'd it be like that. But it's glad to have you back, man. And in a victorious time, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Because I know me and Ross been, we touch on every beginning of every pod. I know they probably be like, all right, we get it. Y'all doing good, but it's the Texans. Pod, so suck it. You hear me? <laughs> I don't care, um, bro. With another magnificent <laughs> win this past Sunday, man. Hey, man. For Loving it. it. I was hey. at work Take yelling at people. Taking While I was room. delivering packages, <laughs> I'm a, I got I got one earbud in. It's oh, telling me, every, yeah. bro, I'm I <laughs> randomly celebrating. I dropped the package. I'll turn around. and say, yeah! in the middle of somebody's yard, and this one dude was looking at me. I was like, and then I kept walking mm-hmm. to the Hiya. truck. <laughs> Hiya, nah, man. Texan just scored. <laughs> yes, sir. That, that pass to Tank was. Um, <laughs> Until he said, "He said, nah, I don't want that." The 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 whole route was crazy. The route was fire. (laughs) It was. (laughs) It was so the, that communication too, though. Yeah, he kept his eye contact with yeah. each other. He said, "No, nah, yeah. go for it." He said, "No, nah, no, nah. yeah, go for that, fam." Hey, we, I want we, that. We have us something in Houston, man, and I love to see it. Um, that's On why the we, money. That's why we always talk about it at the beginning of every episode because it's something to be proud of. Yeah, for sure. After for dealing sure. with the trials and tribulations of this entire franchise, I see what you did with trials, and right. you know it's the truth, man. After all the BS we dealt with. To finally be able to wake up Sunday, you know, and, and watch the Texans get the job done yeah. on a consistent basis, or <clears throat> actually have the opportunity to win games, is imagine is waking man. up on a Sunday Facts. having the feeling that my team could win today. Right. Yeah, that's, that's, you know what I mean? <laughs> another stressful day. Yeah, you like, oh, it's here stressful. Team. It Texas been playing been... today. I love them, but uh, you know. Just get this pizza though. Get this yeah. discount for I pizza. Just, I just watched the game. Yeah. And and what Ross said was true <laughs> yesterday. He, uh, when he called me about it, he was like, it's, "It feels good to know because um, they had scored, mm-hmm. and we was down uh, seven zero. And he was like, "Bro, it feels good to know that even though we're down right now, you're confident that the team yes. going to come back mm-hmm. and and they can actually score." So and you know I, I thought about that. And I'm like, yeah, you're right. Because so many times when we get down a touchdown, it's you like know, you kind of already can hang it up. Yeah, for, you know, <laughs> yeah, us, back yeah. in the day for sure. Yeah. yeah so uh, the fact that now we can still after have a after hold. last week against the Bengals and we we did basically the same thing. Uh, we were down seven zero, and I was like, okay, yeah. I was so confident. I was all like, right. all right, it's normal too. Then man. we we got down again. I was like, eh, I ain't worried about it. Yeah, we'll just <clears throat> sure enough, and we did that. I just really should have been a blowout, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Kind of decide to go out and style, but it's cool. Like, we'll take that W. Yeah. <laughs> we facts, will facts, take facts, it. Facts, you facts. can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah. And I've completed my uh expectations. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Appreciate that. Mm-hmm. You I met said your we win, gonna win, your win least, rate. I said we're gonna win at least six games. That's what I said. I was I at seven. Six, I was six to ten. That's the yeah. range I was in. I, I said we're gonna win at least six games. Uh, six or seven, but uh, I said we're gonna win at least six, mm-hmm. and everything else now is just gonna be a bonus. At this yeah, point everything at this point, people is was a bonus. what we was gonna go <laughs> for uh, sure. But it was oh, I was just gonna win two games, three games. Yeah, I won the same amount y'all won last year. Okay. Yeah, um, like I'm now like, that I, right. I never believed. <clears throat> yeah, no, mm, yeah. I, I felt like respect. this team was it had it vastly improved from last season, and just <clears throat> off the coaching and off the what they did 
in drafting as well. That we killed that drafting. led me we know, yeah, and sure. just what you had been saying going <clears throat> to the training camps, it let me know like this is not the same team mm-hmm. or whatnot. And it's good to be able to see them proving it. The fact that he's being in conversations for MVP mm-hmm. as a rookie, as a rookie. That's that's crazy in that's itself. Enough. So you know, uh, this Sunday we're playing Jacksonville. Um, they uh, <clears throat> another uh, big game. Uh, they are the division leaders, I believe. So yeah, they're the division they leader, leaders. So we're trying to fight we'll, them for the uh, yeah, pretty much to be we, number one. We beat them. We beat number one in the AFC South, and we already beaten them once this year. Mm-hmm. So we need to go ahead and sweep do it again. Yeah, yeah do go it ahead again. and sweep them, and keep, uh, keep that carry that momentum on mm-hmm. going forward, bro. Because I. I'm be honest with you. If he's able to get us to the playoffs, that's I know we know they they're not gonna really want to vote for him as an MVP, you know, winner. But I will say this: if by some crazy way that it happened, and it's not even out the realm of a possibility, far from out. If realm. if he's able, because you know, going through Kansas City, that's probably going to be the way to get to the Super Bowl, mm-hmm. right? Sure. We get to an AFC championship game and we actually win that shit, MVP. Simple. I, I even think before. I mean, it's not. I, I, I would say before, but we know based off the voting, they're not yeah, going to no, do no, it. No. I mean, even it, if we made it to far. the playoffs, but if it's that not was, too far off from. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. If that's something that could ever possibly happen, making it to the playoffs and making it that far again to get to, uh, to the AFC championship game, mm-hmm. we'll get to that point. Just off the season we've had, yeah, yeah. We 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 got we can go a step beyond that. We can go MVP, offensive rookie of the year, of course, of course. and then you can go coach of the year. Yep, yep. Same same thing. Facts. Same both same rookies. Thing. Yep, Facts. both rookies. Facts. That's true. <laughs> rookie head coach, rookie offensive he, coordinator. They turned this franchise around. This yeah. is he, he is t- changed the culture when it comes to the Texans. I haven't heard the stadium yeah. that loud. Since bro. like Watson in eighteen, mm, bro, bro, and, Watson, and even Watson then, I don't think I, it felt that loud, like bro. as loud as it was the last time when I was in there for that. Uh, uh when they played, game, game oh. was that when we got the game, the forty six seconds. Mm-hmm, mm, oh, I forgot who they. I played, have never bro. been in the stadium <clears throat> that loud, Buccaneers. But yeah, 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 yeah. Boy, it was, was yeah, 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 It yeah, felt like yeah. the stadium was shaking. I was like, this is crazy. It's like, rocking up is, in here. This is crazy. Right. <laughs> And the thing is, we haven't just beaten, like, you know, people make that argument, oh, the, look at the caliber of teams. We haven't just beaten scrubs. Like, the Bengals ain't no scrubs. scrubs. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Still his defense ain't, ain't no, no scrubs. scrubs. Yeah. Saints either. Even. Saints definitely ain't no scrubs either. Hey, Buccaneers. Hey, yeah, like, there's. Bucks ain't no scrubs. There's some good quality yeah. teams out there. Of course, we know Cincinnati. Our, our, um, our um, schedule was actually ranked top 10, I want to say, before the season. So yeah, we, we had a, a very, very. Just looking off. I mean, that's kind of why people were making the speculation of our season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How it was mm-hmm. going to be. They knew it was going to lose against the Bengals. They knew it was going to lose against the Bucks. They just knew. Um, it's so many knew. narratives that have changed since the season started. For sure. Like, the. Um, Bryce Young, and, Bryce Young, and and yeah. CJ thing. This yeah. their new thing now. They like, uh, well, CJ landed in a more ideal spot. But before the season, the Texans were the dif- dysfunctional team that nobody wanted to be at. I think people mm-hmm. forgot that things are recorded now. Uh, that's, yeah. that's what I'm saying. Yeah. These their are tweets, the internet, my boy. The tweets and the things that they people was uploading and saying. Even, even from, when we went from, live on the draft. Even from uh, people in the our comments, fans, people from in the comments Texas was fans. being real funny. Yeah, you know, from Texans fans too. Talking about Bryce is landing in the most ideal <laughs> spot. Yeah. Why? And then, I mean, people did give us a lot of credit when they start seeing how we um, was moving around and and getting up in the draft and switching and stuff. Oh like yeah, that. that that so that trade up was oh, people oh, people was acknowledging it. Great, bro, bro fantastic. And uh, you know, fantastic. But hey, we we here now, so yeah. we're we're forever humble. Yeah, yeah. we're just appreciative. Um, Absolutely, ready. We we're just ready to, to talk. not yeah. only support. Our team, but we're ready to kind of have our chest out, you know, because for sure it's been a long time it's, since it's time. It's, we yeah, deserve it, goddammit. We thought we had it, but you know, massage is more important in some sometimes situations. You know, you know. Meanwhile, uh, all that money yeah. is going <clears throat> to rehab right now because yeah, yeah. boy's out for the season. So, yeah. oh yeah, he is out for the season. He's out for the season, yeah, which which kind of really made you know what's crazy? That game Cleveland for Christmas stays Eve stays building us out. I don't know what they have over Cleveland in their top. In their organization, but this is not the first time Cleveland has bailed us out. 
Casario's cool with so, like a lot of staff over there for oh, some reason. Okay. So like he's done a lot of like moves with them. I've noticed. Cause bro, even <laughs> I think even Bob Bob did some moves with them <clears throat> before uh, Casario had showed up. Damn, bro, that's Bob. That's that's crazy, man. I didn't want to mention his name. Yeah, I, of course. That's why I see he spelled it. <laughs> yeah, but now it's Mc- just crazy how anytime McNugget. we need to get rid of some some bad situations, they'll give us. Uh, a goddamn full bouquet of options. Here we go. We'll take it. You know what I'm saying? We Don't probably, worry about it. The crazy got, thing about the Browns on them. is their damn defense is so damn good. They yeah. still winning. They are. They it's just annoying. Beat, uh, who they beat uh, yesterday? Uh, they beat... Because um, we were just watching yeah, the end we, of the game. We watched that yesterday, too. Who was uh, that that they freaking... And it was a close Steelers. one. Too. Steelers. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. uh, Chisel, Chisel was hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah. Chisel, I'm sorry, bro. I was like, you so used to being the top tier team, so I understand the pain. They're like eight and three, right? Who? Uh, Cleveland, or is it seven three? Seven three. Seven three. Yeah, yeah seven three. Some crazy. Yeah, so and we played them later on too. Uh, yeah, see, oh, that's what the game we were going to try to go to. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because we were expecting we the show. Yeah, I wanted yeah, Deshaun so. to be there. So Everybody like, did. Because like, eh. I was trying to go to that one too. Yeah, this yeah, actually, she was just about to buy the tickets. <laughs> And when yeah. I found out he was there, I was like, oh, yeah. hold on. Don't now. care no more. Yeah. I'm still going to watch that motherfucker because that's oh, my shit. Sure. That that's yeah, that's definitely going to be a... Uh, that, 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 defense, that defense is ridiculous, bro. bro. That's going to be a real, real hey, challenge. Hey, shout out to Singletary, bro. Like, he really been stepping it up on the run game. Like, See, just, it's just the, the... The funny thing about that, like, not to cut you off, nah, but go ahead. the funny thing about that is we... We kind of a few uh, fans and me kind of talked about this because it was like Pierce is a great back, but the thing is, it's the scheme mm-hmm. that kind of works it more, fits more for, for him. Singletary Terry. type of running yeah. back, like a quicker, faster type. Because yeah. when we didn't have a quarterback back. to actually, you know, like CJ Damien, that, kind of Pierce was more so Pierce was more so that power back, power that runner. freestyle runner. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. And so much, yeah. what they have He'll now is a, a lot of. Yes, get out blocks. Yeah, like, it's, it's straight the, to. We know where you need to go. go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Pierce was really on some. Fam, just just get it. Get, get the it. ball and get do it. something, bro. Yeah, and that's and he was doing <laughs> something majority of last year for sure before he got hurt. So I, I uh, will give him time to to adjust. Yeah, uh, sure. I feel like once he adjusts to the new scheme, I feel like he'll be straight. No, he's, sure. he's, he's, still, he's a dog. He's, yeah, 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 he's yeah. a dog, bro. You can't you know teach a dog how to dog. Yeah, I, I think I, if that makes sense. And even the Rockets, maybe he should have said how to bark. Maybe it would have sound a little better. We got Desmond King back too, True. by the way. Oh, Today. Mm, okay, okay. Yeah, and shout out to him. back. And speaking of dogs, yeah, for all of them, for all of them, for all. That was a way to segue. Speaking of the dogs, that was a way to segue. Man, hey, we we finally got the chance to check out uh, the little uh, Scary Hours Three Edition mm-hmm. uh, for uh, for all the dogs, and uh, I think tracks. we all can agree. Those six tracks felt like they should have been on that album. Oh, yeah. They Drake. definitely felt like <laughs> they were for all the dogs. He was rapping, rapping. Oh, which, my which, God. Which uh, I love it so much, but it just makes me feel like had he just had those six tracks on there and replaced like maybe eight or ten. Like we've been bro, saying. That would have been a classic album. And I think it would have went. You, he would have had more number ones. Move six out the way and put the six in there. Yeah, or even bro. if you just do an even trade of six. Yeah. Nah, and just line it up better. Yeah, kind of space them out yeah. you know, and fix them in between. Because there's still a lot of good songs on yeah. for all the dogs. Mm-hmm. But it's a lot of skips. There Absolutely. How many songs is on the album? Like 13? Yeah. Like 14? 20? 21. Oh, it's 20? Yeah, it's like 21. See, that's how, that's how many yeah. I don't listen to. That's why yeah. I say like 10. <laughs> yeah, about good. Okay, that's so like 8 or 10 is a little better. Yeah, like drop it down to like 16 tracks. It'd be nice. Bro, yeah, because that, that, <laughs> yeah. that sounded like it was for all the dogs. Yeah, no, no that, for real. That Every was, single song. That he should have named sweet. that. He should have named the, the instead of Scary Hours 3, he should have named it for all the dogs for real. For real. <laughs> FR at the end. <laughs> just put FR at the end. <laughs> oh, that was for all the dogs, but for real, for real this time. Yeah. For real. This for real, for real all the parentheses, this Joe Button. Yeah. For real, parentheses, <laughs> Joe Button. Yeah, Red cause, Buttons. Cause nah, Joe, let him know. <laughs> I'm still here, bro. Uh, I'm still here. Uh, angry Drake. Oh, frustrated Drake. Is a great Drake when it's it comes a, to music. It's a bar Drake. Drake yeah. was like, oh, "Okay, I got another J Cole track. Let me show y'all. I can, I can, I can be there." Yeah, okay. yeah, bro. Like this. But that's what I was saying. I was like, when we was on the stream, I was like, "Bro, Drake know his position exactly." You know, it's, it's just the people you always got to fight with to that want to compare, which is cool. I get it. It's for the sport, but yeah. at the same time, bro, you've been in this game for that long. 
I don't care what you say. Like, I'm going to rap when I want to. I will probably do, well, not personally, but the honestly, never mind. Like, it's like, I'm not mad. You know, I, I was just mad at what out. you made it seem like it was going to be. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, bro, like, to be honest with you, you've done enough in the game for mm-hmm. me. You know Absolutely. What I'm saying? Like, I'm, yeah, for you sure. You solidified yourself 10 times over. Yeah, um, for at this sure. Point, I mean, can you imagine doing the same thing over and over and over for 10 years plus and being the top of it? You're yeah. going to be hella bored and you're going to have to find something, <laughs> something to do. And he found it. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> he found it for them six songs. He, he let it be known. <laughs> He let it be yeah, known. Yeah, because you ain't heard nothing else about nothing. Ain't no hate Everybody nothing. Everybody talked bad about the last album, but when he put out this new little EP, like EP you know, like, whatever you want to call it, Deluxe, Heat, it was yeah. fire. Mm-hmm. You ain't heard nothing bad. Like you, you can put that, re- press repeat. If you, you don't even have just to separate play. the six, you, you don't have to skip them. Press on. repeat and just keep playing the six mm-hmm. over and over again. You broke my heart. We was talking about it. That shit went so crazy. And I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and probably just because I. I said I was going to do it. I'm going to put my own album. Bye my album. bye. Hmm? With them six. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm going to put my own um, little spin on how you yeah. would yeah. list. Uh, Make your own little playlist. Uh, yeah. How you would. Uh, Father uh, Dogs for Real Playlist. That would be dope. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You, Apple Music and lets you create. Yeah, and then playlist. you can share. I would yeah. usually do that, but that's I, what I would definitely do for that one. Yeah, yeah nah, bro. And that'll be mine. For the dogs, for real. Dog, yeah, bro. and I usually do that with albums, so that way I can hear the songs that I want to listen to back mm-hmm. to back and just kind of vibe out like that. Nah, and then miss out on the skipping. He did his thing. He I did. did. So his shout thing. out to him for all the dogs. And <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he was shooting. He, he was shooting. It felt like everybody was getting hit. He ain't care. It didn't matter, bro. He Ooh. did not care. People I, was getting hit. I was hitting up my DJ homies, even on the stream. You know something good when you middle of whatever you doing, you hit somebody up that you know mm-hmm. is a fan or listen to music like that. I'm like, bro. <laughs> when I say my cousin called me <laughs> while I was at work to mm-hmm. in the middle of the tracks, he's on. He said, I listened to two and a half tracks. I stopped on three. Um, Bro, yep. I said, I already know. I already know. Happy birthday, by the way. I already know. Oh, that's a lot of birthday. Yeah. yeah, he was like, Drake yeah. gave me a birthday gift today, too. That's a lot of birthday. Yeah. These six tracks, I already know they heat. I was like, yes, Bro. you ain't even finished, huh? He's he like, nah. I was like, yep. heat, heat. That's, that's, that's that heat. That's warming it up. That's how that's we that heat. felt. So when it get we cold, was, we needed some heat. When we was, bro, we had Bars. to get something to drink. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We, we got some liquor. Yeah. Like, hold on, let me, let me. Hold you should on. hook me up. You literally <laughs> got to stop each line. Like, all right, you making me stop each line, Drake? Yeah. I ain't heard this you in a minute. Say, hold on, man. Whoop, 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 whoop. You ain't did this to me in a minute. Damn. I was like, dog. You feel me? got to go back. Boy, had you rewinding? Yup. Okay. Okay. Them, no. Oh, you're that not gonna let down. me breathe? Yeah, okay. That, that Robbie Downey uh, Jr. Oh, bar. Yes, that, yeah. that 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 was it. I was like, okay. I'm this here. nigga say I'm you done. uh you shooting over the web. You Spider Man. I was like, <laughs> hold on, dog. Wait, <laughs> wait. You shooting over the, the web? web. I was like, all right. There's so many all jewels right, on there. So many gems, definitely. If you haven't checked it out, definitely bars on bars on bars. Out. We got some other music we definitely plan on checking out. The Two Chains and Two Lil, Chains, Wayne, Lil Wayne uh, yep. collab, I believe. Meek Mills. I Rick like them Ross. on a the project together. Two Chains mm-hmm. and Lil Wayne. It's it's, they're, they're, it's like they're fun together. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like they, they collab real nice. Together. Yeah, I don't mm-hmm. overthink it. It's like they make some dope bangers. Yeah, mm-hmm. like so. that uh, one track, the dun, 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 dun. like with the whole marching band. I shake the money, mm-hmm. make yeah. money, making yeah. yeah. make money, make. I'm shake the. It's just a tough, like they a vibe. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah they, that, they, that they definitely, definitely found the right mix I together. About that song, mm-hmm. that song. Together. I'm, I'm looking forward to checking that out. Uh, uh, Rick Ross, Meek Mills, that yeah. should be a good one as yeah. well. Yeah, a lot of people have a lot of. I'm not rushing to it. No, I'm, just, I'm, yeah, I'm like just, that with you. Yeah, yeah, like, I'm with you. Brown album. He ain't rushing to that album. So the next one we gonna check out. I was rushing to Chris when Chris had 11 tracks. Rushing. I mean, it's been like what two weeks. Oh, oh, you ain't here to oh, finish the whole thing. Oh. I was rushing to Chris when he had eleven tracks. Yeah, yeah. And we found out he had an extra eleven on top of that. Okay, wait. <laughs> he said, wait "You a mean twenty two? He said, "Wait a second. Oh, hold on. Bro. You gotta listen All to right. that song. So, okay. With him in future. It's cool. Um, I mean, I could listen to one song. <laughs> it's cool. It go hard. I like it. It's cool. You heard it. I heard the whole album like seven times. Well, I'm it, a Chris Brown stand. Oh, okay. So I was upset okay. because I wasn't there. It wasn't it wasn't there. It was cool, but it wasn't there. I mean <laughs> kind of the same way we did jerk. That's why you keep noticing I keep talking same about way. a few songs. Um, it's okay. Oh yeah, yeah. You, gotta, you got you do have to pick it like that. That's yeah. really how you do. Chris Brown gonna drop a and it's crazy because they want it. <laughs> They want to be in the. Uh, you already know reaction. he is. Oh, they did. Yeah, some people was like, "Man, I hope y'all listen to Chris Brown you, with Nisha." Yeah, we. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, First of all, take it easy. First yeah. of all, take I it love easy. Chris Brown is. Yeah. yeah. That guy. 
for me. Yeah, yeah all right. <laughs> so, uh, Little Wayne and Two Chains, we'll be checking that out next, man. Looking for it. <laughs> See how I don't hate. All I right. Mean, I mean, but when it's Maya, for some reason, I'm wrong. And I didn't. That was an issue between you and Ross. I had Ooh, that I have nothing issue, to do with this. Are, that's in the past. <laughs> if you, Ross is like, stop if you it. haven't seen a dissension, <laughs> dissension since then. <laughs> no, there hasn't been no dissension. <laughs> oh my god. Like hmm, I should have, but well, there was no dissension. Steve wasn't here. That was. I wanted to be because yeah. that was hilarious. He was supposed to be the judge, but I know the trial has been over. Yeah, it's, it's over. I don't want to bring let it, it go. <laughs> but I will say, mm-hmm. Ross has been trying to get away from this man. <laughs> he haven't. Did Look, you man. pin that? Yes, of course I pinned that. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah, exactly. It's, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Why wouldn't I pin Why that? Why would you? You've done other hella other things that you could have pinned. <laughs> I would name it, but I ain't gonna mess your character up. So I'm, I'm gonna let it go. Saying. I'm just saying. This guy. I'm just saying. I ain't gonna mess his case. Other things you could have pinned. No, why? I think because I was on Instagram the other day and I think I had seen. I said, "Oh, he pinned it." And the woman looks at me. He's like, (laughs) "Wow, that's." He still hasn't liked that picture, y'all. By the way, I I I just want you to know there's over five thousand people that like it. Come on, Doug. You should like like it. You should be proud of him. Five thousand people want to put the number out. You should be proud of him. Five thousand idiots. Tell you that. That's cool. Hey, I think Boy. I'm an idiot. Yeah, because he liked it too. <laughs> Sorry, Steve. I think Steve. I did too, babe. Sorry, babe. <laughs> Sorry. Because I saw, okay, I see Nisha. I see, all right, cool, cool. This nigga looking for the light. <laughs> you you, 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 know, you, you got too much time on your hand, bro. He's he only looking for like, like important things. Yeah, yeah, I don't want to hear that shit. Yeah. You, try, you heard, you ain't want to say that until Steve said it. Because I saw the names. I was like, you heard, he told some man, important, important people. I was like, damn, bro. Oh. Oh, I didn't like it. Oh, cool. that's cold. I'm not liking it. <laughs> He's not gonna like he it. He won't, bro. I'm actually, I'm think I was gonna report it, but wow. oh my at God. least I didn't do that. Report my picture with my yeah. Bro, that's cool. If Instagram asks me though, I'm gonna be like, yeah, I don't want to see this. He said, yeah, you wow. got to report that. The thing was the fact that like she was here. I should have pushed that. Why am I seeing this? You never this? had a chance to do that. <laughs> you know that little thing you can. Why am I seeing this on my page? Wow, bro. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Avoid cold, this. Man. I'm straight. That's, that's crazy. Cold, that's that's crazy, crazy, bro. But at least I didn't. I didn't just hit you with like a number. Like, oh, hit him with a scroll. Not what my fan he is. Hit him with a scroll. That's all right. You know. <laughs> that's cold, bro. That's cold. Yeah, that's cold, man. Not I, the scroll. I expected better, but it happens. No, it's all good, bro. <laughs> it's just straight. You straight. Um, <laughs> I'm not gonna take us back there because we already had a pod on that. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Yep, yep. Yep. Good ahead. energy. Good energy. Good that? energy. Pod number. 91, 92, somewhere, somewhere in that area. You know, y'all go check it out. You know, I think like 94. I can't remember. Yeah. <laughs> Anywho, hey, this week, Thanksgiving. It, ooh, mm-hmm. I can't uh, I'm ready for what it. What y'all eating? So ready for it. What do y'all, yeah, what is y'all most anticipated <laughs> like dish? <laughs> most anticipated. <laughs> Hold on, first of all, who got that, oh, that commercial? K- it was a KFC or? Bro, one of them <laughs> stole the flow yeah. of the green and they beans changed. and potato, and they changed the wording for their. If y- y'all know who I'm talking about, a wow. foodie. I think it was. They stay doing it. Was that. A, I, was like, I, uh, I said, bro, did they give remiss? Uh, God doubt it. Credit? Yeah, I doubt, I doubt it, bro. Because they they probably changed it up as much as they could, but kept the cadence. No, you yeah. know it's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You definitely know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But they still change it up for you know a couple words. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so he can't be like, hey, you know, even though that, the cadence. I felt is, like, damn, bro. But a lot, of, I've been noticing it though. Like a lot of commercials, I know we're gonna go back to Thanksgiving, but mm-hmm. I know a lot of a lot of commercials have been taking ideas from memes. people who do things on yeah. like memes and TikToks. Yeah. Like I've, I'm been like yeah, always. Yeah, They've been blatant. doing that since the beginning of the time, technically. Yeah, yeah. It's just, it but now it's even TikToks. more. Mm-hmm. It's even more now because now, oh, free game, mm-hmm. homie, appreciate it. That was just they were just stealing. You just didn't know it. Yeah, yeah. Nah, it's just mm-hmm. like, now we're seeing it live. Like, <laughs> hey, good. I, that's me. <laughs> I saw that on TikTok. You. Okay. <laughs> Whole commercial making millions. Making millions. Off of their stuff. Off your stuff. But yeah, shit, wow. Thanksgiving is this week. It is. It is. And uh, to answer your question, it's always going to be the mac and cheese. Mac and ham, cheese? Okay. I'm a, mac and cheese and ham for me. Man. I love that too. I love the ham. Give it's me that some ham. Uh, that cornbread ooh. dressing. Broccoli, cheese. It's and the rice. ham, the cornbread dressing, the rolls. Like the broccoli, cheese, and rice casserole. Mm-hmm. That's mm-hmm. what it is. Mm-hmm. Oh my God. Oh my God, yes. So everything with cheese. Yeah. Cheese, man. Yeah. Mac and cheese. Cheese, man. Sometimes broccoli. my mom yeah. make these, like, uh, she'll mm-hmm. make these little wings, like, like fried chicken wings. Ooh, Just oh, that's what my mom my be doing. God. With, like, the rolls. I'm not yeah. even going to like, like, Warren's mom, fried chicken. I think I'm only that's had how it once. I feel about my. Oh my God. 
It, undefeated. It, it really is undefeated. She do the fried chicken wings too. Oh, she do fried God. chicken. Fried or just the fried chicken in general. She, general. general. she know how to she... fried chicken. I want that recipe. Shout out to the South, man. Shout out to her, bro. Yeah. Shout out to the everybody South. used to tell my mom she needed to, she need to be, open like, a everybody restaurant. Everybody that tried like, her chicken. I from think... when I was little, they yeah, I've only had it once. Tell her to stop playing. Yeah, your surprise birthday party we had her make. Wish I would tell her to stop playing. I wasn't surprised. No, your birthday party we had for your thirtieth. We had her make. No, I think I was was I thirty or twenty. I think I was 29. No. The 30th birthday party at the venue we had. She oh, had the venue, yeah. Yes. Yeah, mm-hmm. But I remember when she, we did it at a, a kid's event. It was event. some good chicken. Mm-hmm. It was a kid's event we did that she really. Whenever you know, we ask her to, she'll make it. I'm thinking about it for Because she, yeah, be she don't her. be wanting to cook now. You know, she. Go yeah, ahead and ask her and bring older. me a plate. <sighs> Bro. It is. I'm fine. trying to get the, you know. We might make three, three trips this time. <laughs> <laughs> My parents, her parents, Dove's parents. I mean, Dove's house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely getting the plate. Yeah, for sure. Slide some, up. They're some like, who's that outside? Don't worry about it. I need that, that, <laughs> that cornbread dressing. I've been trying to learn how to do it, how she do it. That's hard because bro. it's like it to is. copy it's somebody else's yeah. perfection. I yeah. noticed that everybody literally makes cornbread dressing different. Like, yes. Like literally for my family, like for him is different. So he'll eat my mom's cornbread so the, dressing. Yeah. Because he says, hey, be it's careful, good be as careful well. what you're saying on the pod now. But, <laughs> Uh, he says, like, it's just different. So, you know, like, that's funny you say that because I hated dressing before yeah. I met my, before my stepmom started making it. Oh, Because oh, really? she makes a sweet dressing. Yeah, that's mm. what my mom makes. So, I like sweet yeah. dressing. I found this out. He's not used to the sweet. I, my dad isn't either. So, my dad is like, you know, the, the is more. Sweet? It is sweet. Yours, yeah, yeah. My mom, it's more of a sweet. like, a, Your mom's is not it's just sweet. breaded with like, I guess, some meats or something in mm-hmm. it or whatever. I don't like that. Like, yeah. I don't want gravy. I don't want none of that. That's I want it sweet sure. with cranberry sauce. It's not sauce. gravy. It's not uh, gravy. She makes it with... It's not... It's, it's like, like more of a drier... Yeah, yours is more drier. But... That too. It's okay, but I, I, I'd rather... That's fair. The sweeter one. We ain't trying to... We ain't going for no verses. It's, it's, it's nothing wrong with that. Because my mom... I, I see nothing wrong with... I still... I eat it every time <laughs> nah, she makes damn it. damn all that. You know what you I see said. nothing wrong with that. But then my stepmom started making it, and she, she was new to it and everything. And I was like, I want my dressing like this. This is what I want. I like mm-hmm. this. So I will literally pull up to make sure I get some dressing from her. But like, we'll go back to Kess's family, and they do like my dad's side, and they have like the not so sweet dressing i'm like i can't eat it I'm done. I, I need mm-hmm. to get my other dressing yeah. and it's nothing wrong dressing. with it like yeah. i'm sure it's Give good to the and people that like it i'm saying like it's, it's good still but <laughs> it's just, and even i'll eat it i just noticed everybody makes it different for sure oh, for yeah, sure no. and, De- and it still ends up being good but it's just good in their own way mm-hmm. you know that's the only thing i was saying for sure <laughs> Yeah, no, nah, my mama dressing fire. He, he said, "I ain't trying to hear." Oh, no, no, I get that. it. No, I, I get, get it. it. But I'm pretty much the same way. My mama dressing no, fire. That's yeah. literally how I feel. Fire as hell, man. It is. My mama dressing you fire. Know it. You know it's that's fire. where I'm at. <laughs> I guess because the first year, go ahead, go ahead. You talk about it. The first year I went <laughs> had Thanksgiving with your people. Uh-uh. The dressing, the dressing was a little different. You yeah. know, it was an acquired taste for you. Yeah, but it wasn't. It wasn't nasty. It was just like for sure. It, the texture. It just. Not the texture. I. I was. I was like, "Where's the dressing?" At? I just. You're eating it. It was a little bit. I more. avoided dressing that wasn't sweet. I just didn't like it at mm-hmm. the time when I was younger. I can eat it now. I guess because I'm. I guess your your palate Mature, changes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Your palate changes, so I can eat both now. But before, I was like, "Nah, I don't like that. Don't put that on my." But plate. you see what will make it sweet, even. Cause I, I wouldn't say sweet or unsweet from my mom. I, I don't know. I couldn't tell you if it's gotcha. that dynamic, well, but the cranberry one is more sauce. moist than the other. Like gotcha. my mom's is a little bit more moist. And That's his, the case for yeah, us his pretty mom's much. It's like a drier. perfect blend. Yeah. But um, I would always get the corn. I mean the uh, cranberry. cranberry sauce. Yeah, yeah. cranberry sauce saves me. It does. And it's, it's like it, I, I gotta put a whole lot. <laughs> well, I don't even gotta do all I, that. I don't gotta go all deep. Anybody's dressing, I have to make sure I put a lot of cranberry. Sauce. I love cranberry I sauce. Love it. It's tasty I love good. cranberry sauce too. So, I, if you didn't know, the the cornbread dressing is the one that I'm, yeah. and the macaroni. Yeah, I was about to say it's definitely the yeah. dressing for him. And if it's gonna be, yeah, yeah. If it's gonna be, yeah, nah, I could already tell. I gotta, let you, I gotta let y'all try it. So y'all, because sure. I can't. Dressing is definitely it. one of them for me. That's why I was like, I can't the describe cheese it. Casserole, my bad, and um, and that in the dressing for Brock sure. Broccoli cheese definitely fire. Cause yeah, cheese my uncle good. used to, um, but my aunt also is really good with it. So I it's like mm-hmm. making that dish those two man. What broccoli cheese casserole? Okay. 
Is that a bad thing? Put the cam on Ross. Oh, Lord. Like, what? It's not a bad thing. Put the cam on me. Because I know it's a camera without <laughs> like, Yeah, being, I, I get why the camera's over here, but. <laughs> I was like, oh, Lord. <laughs> All right, man. You know, no, that's cool. Saying? It's just, you it's know. It's good? Yeah. No, that's cool. It's just, now, let's be real here. Yeah, be real. <laughs> I don't want to make no. Uh, uh, no. 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 Damn, no. you're not living your truth, really, then. Damn, that's... You gotta live in your truth. But Nisha, then, Nisha can speak on it because... Nisha, yeah, yeah. living your truth. That's just your family, so... Nisha, where the mic at? Extra seasons her damn food. Extra seasons. And not extra. So like, it's no, like it's, over flavor. It's, it's like heart good. attack. It's good. Whoa. It's good, but like you feel like you dying good. Whoa. Well, that's... And the, you know what the thing is? It's not that... Because that doesn't sound bad. But the thing it's is, just, I grew up with... Like, my dad had heart problems. I so my so mom little, never cooked with a lot of seasoning a lot more modern and salt gotcha. she we i literally didn't eat salt look nobody in my up. house had heart problems and we still feel like she put too much <laughs> damn <laughs> yo damn. i'm just trying to yo say he's trying to conserve it yeah. <laughs> he's trying to be you know politically correct yeah you know it, it was just the only thing for me i mean that's fair though if you're not used to it too, yeah, like it, it'll be tough even like when i when i first started like eating a lot of salt because people will be Having it, in. you remember when people would just bring yes. salt and dash it out they person. And I when I would see that, like I'd be like, that. "Bro, huh? that's, so, that's too much." I was always foreign, but people was always like, "You know, salt. A moderate amount of salt adds a good flavor no. to whatever." No, I'm saying like moderately when you're cooking, <laughs> moderately like fries and stuff like that. You know, like moderate. But when I I would taste certain things, I'd be like, "Ooh, that's too and salty." It would just be a little bit make your face turn. So, but no, nah, it was really the um, the it was the yams. <laughs> It was a yam. I opted to make them this year. Can so. I get to them yams? I was gonna make it. Yeah, I was gonna get my mom to do it. Was it that bad? Wait, who has well, it? It's, who it's, made the yams? Okay, look. Let's in case you oh, watching. No, she made it. I love you. I love you. Sis, For sure, we love you. But so, I, I, I to she, know it's all love. We then love. you said her name. Oh! But Damn. I went ahead and um, I went ahead and you can leave it out. Got the yams. No, I ain't doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, leave it <laughs> in. This is real. Leave that in. We're all set. We're gonna live our Speak your truth, man. I was. It's just I was going in for the yams last year. Uh, well, no, this was the year before last. Damn, because so we remembers. decided last year not to do it like that because it's a lasting memory. I'm still a little hungry, but um, I'm still a little hungry. You don't have to highlight. Uh, but, <laughs> nah, you so said I what went, you said. I went to bite in the yams and I, I start crunching. And what? I was just like, wait. Yeah, what? thank you. Put this camera on Steve too, please. Well, give me. I, Did you put it on Ross? You said crunching. Yeah, it was How crunch. the hell? Yams it was a crunch. Don't crunch. So I, I <laughs> yeah, knew, should not be crunching, bro. I don't get scared. I don't get scared of a lot. But when, when it's dealing with my food, when you said that. that's some scary. I, I got terrified because I, I was like, like, yeah, I didn't know what. <laughs> I okay, know what so I wait, this, is, this is a story. Yo. Right? So she uh-uh. decided to, for the first time, just she do a, something she's seen on TikTok for Thanksgiving. Oh. So you don't did. experiment on people on Thanksgiving. So nah, she put almond I said nuts. That. Oh. Almond nuts. Yeah, it was nuts in the in and the, yams. the damn yams. Tell me something. She with the marshmallows. She says she's. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> We got Thanksgiving right around the corner. You don't know what dish you want to make? Watch this TikTok and you'll surprise your family. I promise you. Yeah, that is. You definitely go surprise your family. Yeah, she's surprised. Everybody at the table, like, what the fuck is no, going wait. on? Yeah, that's one of the things. It was my oldest people. brother. Like, he's a joke. He don't hold water. Oh, he ain't got no filter to this. Nah, you know, yeah. oldest brother. Yeah, no. Nah. He's, he's like, what the fuck is I know he was confused. Hell you know, no, bro. I was just like, that's one of the things you got to tell people about. I put like a label. You, you know, felt that disrespected. Had, that's yeah, why. It just caught me off guard. <laughs> you felt disrespected. My kids love yams. <laughs> oh, bro. Hey, nuts and in the new, yams is wild. That's, my children. Kids are the worst because they're going to tell you. My yeah. children, my you have to. Hard. Why is it crunchy? Yeah, you got to stop them before yeah. they opinionate. Absolutely. Because they'll go. Because so, kids don't care. Yeah, nah. they don't. <laughs> it's free game with kids for sure. But yeah, hurt it hurts your feelings in a heartbeat. It got me. I was just like, man, why the yams? Like, and it kind of caught me off guard and I was kind of off of it. I was like, well, this me, Thanksgiving, that's it. <laughs> Push this to the side. You know how when a DJ go, <laughs> so, do, so do you, so so when you don't like something, do you throw it away with pride or do you like, you know? Man, my sister's- uh, Kindly throw no, this stuff away. So wait, my sister's boyfriend, it was his first time doing Thanksgiving was that year too. It was first year, like, doing Your other sister. Yeah, my other mm-hmm. sister. So- Not the one who got? cooked the yams too. Yeah. Huh? How many sisters you got? Two. Okay. Two sisters, two brothers. 
It's five of us. Got you. So anyway. I know it was two brothers. Mm-hmm. So basically, my other sister's boyfriend came over. Put and the mic he, closer to your mom. And he was making. There you go. He ate the food, but he, I guess, like he said, it was his first time eating it. He was honest. Like he literally told us that he didn't like, really care for it. He wasn't honest. The yams? He, didn't do that. he just didn't really eat it. Talking about the yams? My mom asked him why he didn't eat it. And he was like, uh. <laughs> he didn't. So, he mean, didn't do it. He he wasn't like that. He ain't crazy. He he was just like. I, I mean, didn't say he said much. It but just, he didn't. He didn't say that. He didn't hit the. He hand. didn't hit all that. But it just. You can just tell he didn't really want to eat it. Like he just didn't eat it like that. He was just used to his own. The specific yams. I think he's like used to his own. He was used to his own people's cooking. Uh, understand, uh, which is cool. Yeah. Understand. And, yeah. But they didn't like that. I and, think that's what helped. I, I didn't. Oh, say anything. they didn't like. No, that. I didn't. But. <laughs> but my, how do you tell people their food isn't what it is to you? Without them getting offended, because exactly. you do what he did. You people did, get, you but they still got it. offended. <laughs> yeah, there's away. no way, really. Yeah. Honestly, I mean, because when you're well, used I got to something, fake. you're used to something. The the thing about me and Kess that made it beautiful, because she loved my people's food and she didn't like like one thing. I didn't like like one thing, mm-hmm. so it was easy because. I can just mix it up a little bit, move something to the side. Right. So it looked like I ate most of my plate anyway. I grab a bite here. Yeah. And I'm like, all right, look like I destroyed my plate for the most part. <laughs> <laughs> and Kess could have did the same thing, yeah. really. And, um, Fam, i tell you this. Every year, I eat my mom food first. And then we go to Nisha that's fair. house. Yeah. And then I'll be kind of good. So now I can just pick at yeah. whatever things I like. What you like specifically. Plate. I mean, yeah. I was going to say, it's never really been like, I'm not going to say he don't like the food. Yeah, no, yeah. it's not that I don't like it. It's just something used to. Both, like, we kind of like, because I remember <coughs> when I first met him, I wasn't a soul food eater. Gotcha. So I didn't eat like, his family introduced me to that. Gotcha. Because in mm-hmm. California, we didn't really. I think really, you had it. You just didn't. I, I was California like, different though. Yeah. like I Because yeah. my family in Cali, they have a different type yeah, of Yeah, I wasn't soul really food. like. Yeah. Like the dirty rice. Yeah. I never had that. Fat burger. Until yeah. I moved out here. So <laughs> it was like. <laughs> Been deprived of the dirty rice? Well, I'm just saying, I just crazy. never had it. it was, but a lot of people mm-hmm. don't. I'm from up north. I'm not from So for me, it's like, that was like, mm-hmm. I like that stuff. What is it called? Boudin? Boudin? Right? <laughs> what is it called? Boudin? 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 Yeah. Yeah. Nah, yeah. yeah. Well, on, no. But that's right. understandable, though. I, I know a lot of people yeah. like that. A lot of that stuff, like, I didn't even. Mm-hmm. Change her life. It was new. So yeah. to life. at first when I used to come around, his mom and him used to kind of look at me and they used to crack jokes because I never used to eat my food. Mm-hmm. So yeah, yeah. now that they used to say, that, oh, Nisha ate her food. Bro, Nisha be in that whole two plates. I'll be looking like, damn, Nisha. <laughs> at first, I, it took me you a while. You had to adjust. Like, it took me a while. So. Damn, she that be was... on that mac and cheese. Yeah. When my mom, when my sister oh. made that crusted mac and cheese. Bruh. Uh, where there's just enough crust and mm-hmm. just enough cheese yeah. to where you. That's Kess. Kess now. She, cause she loves my family's mac and cheese, so she'd be like, "Can I get some more mac and cheese?" Like mm-hmm. she used to whisper it. Now she'll literally go to my mom, and be like, "Yeah, I need another uh, thing of the mac and cheese. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get some more of that." Like <laughs> that's the one thing she bring more. She I think I grab more. like some turkey and it's a couple other things I bring from her family all the time. Mm-hmm. That's the beautiful thing about us, cause we both have Louisiana roots, yeah. like as well. Oh, y'all both can. Just so like, it's food. really easy. Yeah. It wasn't hard for me to adjust to anything yeah. over there. Even the dressing, I was still eating it. Mm-hmm. I wasn't like in love with it, of course, because you know you like yeah, I like my mama's stuff. To, yeah. But um for the most part, it was not hard to eat anything over there. I was like, oh, this is and then they they sometimes have like gain and stuff for that. Now that was different. They had like wild gain sometimes for like oh, okay, Thanksgiving. Game. So like oh. it don't be like I, it's I, not I, I always regular meat. Else. Got you. It's not always like sometimes you, gotta, you, you gotta have gotta like put a label on this then. Yeah, mm. sometimes like, you had like deer meat, duck, and stuff like that. Oh, shit. Which was dope. I was like, this is, is dope. That's different. It was very different. And it was which cool. Which is still good. You know, yeah, I've never gotta, had uh, like deer meat and uh duck. Oh, deer her dad. I've had deer. When he uh, smoked some deer sausage, yeah, deer, deer sausage. Ste- yeah, like the little that, deer yeah. steaks mm-hmm. or whatever. I don't know what they call, but Oh, that's that's Ooh. like that's like country kind hey. of when I, when I always watching Meat Eater on uh, Netflix. Yeah, he was. He watched Weird Shit. Oh, shout out to old boy. I forgot his name, man. He like, he like watching animals kill each other. It's not Will. Hey, no, that's, First that's, of all, life. that's, that's life. Survival of the fittest. I don't hey, like watching I used animals. to watch that stuff too, but. I don't like, like animals kill each other. I like to watch nature. That's nature. You watch I mean, the animals do kill each other. You learn about the cubs. And I'd be like, Why not? Because, because it's a part of life. It's a part of life. I'm there and I'm like. There's nothing wrong with that. I used to love animal planet. I'm going to go down. She dark. She dark. Oh, okay. Nisha said I'm getting away from here. You know what? 
I'm walking away. She grew up in a different area. I gotta she watch saw straight the animal out of planet. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's a different animal planet. That's not cool. You don't do that. Yes, man. I don't even make you do that. Right. But I'm just saying, like, you can't come at the animals. Like, I you know, I like, watched you watch animals. I like nature and stuff. She said, I sat there and watched you watch yeah, it. Yeah, that's Nisha. So you, is. you're not interested in, like, the, I like geography. the, the nature. animals and nature and stuff like that? I've watched it before with him. Oh, okay. okay. Well, I watch it all the time now. Oh, okay. But see, I'm I, I watch things like my mind work. Like yeah, I'm so yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm so, so random. Like, and I, like I be watching. Mm-hmm. Remember, I told you about the cow hooves. Oh, when yeah. they be shaving Bro. the cow hooves. Bro, I've sat this there and watched that stuff. <laughs> yeah. the, the cow hoof cleaning. Yeah, Spider Man, mean we're friends. <laughs> No, <laughs> Bro, you're swear, not. I yeah. swear to God, that the horses when they yep. do the horses, horses too, and they be shaving and they be, down and all that. Bro, and, why, and niggas why? in the comments be like, "Is anybody up here?" Or maybe a little country. Yeah, we might, we might be a little. Country. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> Bro, when I thought they had a game on that. The little the cow one, I almost downloaded that ad, but bro. I read the reviews and they said it's not real. I'm bro. pretty sure you did. I was bro, that to, shit is oh, interesting. Cause I want to be a hoof guy. That's too. a skill. Uh, There's a, a popular YouTube uh, uh, guy. There's a few of them. The hoof Nate, uh, the hoof guy. Yeah, hoof uh, GP. Hoof bro. GP. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. Y'all weird, bro. Yep. Weird. I'm trying to go. I'm trying to learn how to deer hunt. Oh, hey, man. Bro, same. Hey, the deer hit my car, man, and I hated deer ever since. Oh, yeah. Like, it's, man. You trying to deer? It's been nah, different. Don't kill the family because of one little deer. It, nah. My, my father in law <laughs> already knows how to deer hunt. So I'm like, deer. I might as well learn the trait, and now their whole existence has to go. <laughs> what? You know what I mean? Like, like, oh, yeah, it might be deer lovers on the channel. Hey. Hey, shout out to the deer lovers. Shout out to y'all, but I'm, there's a lot of deer killers. <laughs> We Dude, out here. Are the deer lovers though? Because bro, we out here. Be getting it bad. What, like, what is it that you love about the deer? That's what I want to know. Like, what is the the point of a deer? Animals. What's the they point have, of a deer? To be a part of the ecosystem, like all animals. Deer say, are for like, clothing. Deer are for clothing, food, and hitting your vehicle. Yeah, part of the ecosystem. You got to add that to the book. <laughs> Absolutely, or, I'm still pissed about my damn car getting yeah. hit. You see my shit outside? I didn't see it. It looked good from the Just angle. Just go look at up. it. For, that's why I backed in. Got you. Okay. Damn. I thought y'all was doing a theme. The deer didn't mean it. You stupid, bro. He didn't. No. Well, people don't know. We're in his stuff. You're right. Well, technically, we we're, are. We're yeah, in their they stuff. They were here before us. But Steve survival of the collision. fittest, and I believe in that. Hey. We're the fittest. The animals were here before we were. Animals probably feel like how that about us. Yeah, survival of the fittest. What is the point of the humans? Look at these humans. Survival of the fittest. Different colors. That's nature. That's why I watch Animal Planet too. Start breaking down their trees. You heard them. Using them for paper. All these survival all these different of colors. the fittest. Wood, all that. <laughs> they don't ever hear your foolery. <laughs> Not with all they of it though. Nah, I, I feel that though. I, I really, I really just pissed about the damn deer cold. at the end of the day. The deer pissed me off. Yeah, Steve got into a uh, collision with a, a deer. I was <laughs> dropping off my That's son. This, this, this thing just <laughs> hit you my car. Driving, you was driving uh, westbound. Going approximately, I was driving westbound, 40 miles an hour, about 35, 40, 40 so, miles an uh, hour. You was just 22, 34, just <clears> trying <throat> to drop my son off to school, and, and uh, deer much. said, "Hey!" Deer and I was like, "Oh no!" I tried to dodge, hit my mirror, <laughs> bounced off my passenger door, hit my bumper, and then I looked back, and he was gone. I was like, "He got a concussion for sure." I mean, Damn. she got a concussion for sure because it couldn't have been a he, you know, yeah, like, that, that a little yeah. baby. Yeah. But, well, it wasn't no baby, but it was probably like a. Teen. Female, yeah, for sure. Because <laughs> it was a Teen big, deer. it wasn't no small ass deer. It was just like it didn't have the big hooves. So mm-hmm. yeah, that Damn. shit pissed me off. What if off, it was a, like a a dare? Because I was more worried about my son. <laughs> Some <laughs> other deers <laughs> dared this nigga. As you should be your parent. My Cross son's just sitting here excited, like whoa. See. It's like no. Major, he gotta me. die. <laughs> Major is like a boy, boy. <laughs> like, nah, he is. You know, he got some boys that's like calm and chill. That boy He's don't stop. Boy, boy. Yesterday, I'm folding clothes. He's just jumping on the bed, <laughs> jumping on the clothes, running into me. I was like, okay, I'll just keep folding clothes. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know how every dad want a boy mm-hmm. until you have a boy. Oh my god! And then it's like, <laughs> yo, like. I want to fight you. I'm too young. Yes. But I really, you right really in your want face. to put some hands on you. But you know what? I love you. Right there. <clears throat> I love you, though. Got to learn how to be emotional and tough with you. Oh, that's Absolutely. Funny, that's bro. the only thing. Well, that's girls, the tough part. Girls, you can just be emotional, like, you know, be on that side. And mm-hmm. But boys, you have to balance it. That's the toughness with the boys. You got to you gotta know when not to be too tough and when yep. to be emotional enough. And that is tough. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, it's not easy. And you learning, actually... 
as the day go by, shit, year, month, because they're growing too. Yes. And they're changing constantly. And that boy has been scaring me. Like he hit me with a sentence. He said, See you later, Dad. I was like, Whoa. Wow, not to see you later. Well, yeah. <laughs> Cause I was like, I was like, I, you're I see not even ready for it. Cause I say it all, I say it regularly. I'm like, all right, I'll see y'all later. Uh, love mm-hmm. y'all, blah blah, yeah, yeah. bye, whatever. And then he'd be like, he he said it today, and I stopped because I was about to walk out to go to the uh, studio, come to the studio. He said, "See you later, Dad." And I was like, <laughs> "That messed you up for a second. <laughs> I turned. I said, "What you say?" <laughs> he was like, uh, "See you, you later, later, Dad." We always and I was like, Dad. "Oh." Come on. Okay. <clears throat> Damn, Bye. we always do this. What's wrong? I was so confused. I had never heard him say that, like mm. full sentence like that. Kids are, kids are he'd be like, he'd be like, Bye, Daddy. And that, that's what I'm used to. Mm-hmm. So when he said, I'm like, <laughs> it's through you, You're back. growing up on me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Wait till he get old enough to come to manipulate right? you. Hey, Dad, why don't you? Uh, so I was looking at this the other day. Yeah, you know? not mm-hmm. that I was looking at this. Now, when the I tell you that, day. that's Isaiah to the T. Uh, that that sounds exactly like, like Isaiah. Isaiah. Yeah. <laughs> But I'm I'm super proud of him. And again, I want to say shout out to him. Shout out to Chisel. Um, I hopped in on his live the other day, and uh, he gave a shout out to Isaiah. And I told him, I told him that uh, Isaiah could hear him. Mm-hmm. Um, and he he gave Isaiah a shout out. He said, "Man, I want you to let you know, congratulations, you a champ, house full of champs." Yeah. Facts. And um, he said, "Keep doing what you're doing. It's very important that you keep stay disciplined and all that. Just giving him some encouraging words." So he was mm-hmm. just grinning. <laughs> from ear to ear and I said I said uh no nah, I told him much love and appreciate that you know just all you can do is try to do what you're doing the best of the ability that you can for yeah. sure except whatever decisions that they make and hope that they you know hope that they take from what you put yeah yeah set as a foundation for them mm-hmm. and hope that they remember it you know cuz we all went far <laughs> as you know young adults but that that learning from home, that good learning, mm-hmm. kept us from going too far mm-hmm. over the edge. I mean, yep. we weren't all perfect, but at least we didn't get out of hand to the point where it was no, you know, no return. We all had some good level heads on this, you know for what I'm saying? For so, sure. Um, but I, I do have a couple of questions before we get out of here. One I thought of um, mm-hmm. last, the week before last. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> I heard a conversation, and this is something my mom would always tell me, and it's a, a question I want to pose to y'all. Would you rather know more, have more info about things, or would you rather know less? It depends on the thing. And when I say that, I mean information on people. We can even go as much as what we talk about off mic, like what's going on in the world, like government-wise and stuff like that. So mm. would you rather be a person that know more about- Watch them, guys. <laughs> Not that much. Government. We got him. That was just a quick. That was a quick <laughs> little. <laughs> he said the word. He said the keyword. Fucking alerts them with all. He said the keyword. It's too late. <laughs> they got it before the footage even came yeah. up. Oh yeah, no. they listening live. Yeah. Oh, this is live right now. They're yeah, they already tapped in. They definitely watching. Boy, that Ross man, he's so used to Dan. <laughs> <laughs> but, but for real, like, would you? And and I guess I'll say this. Mm-hmm. You know how when people telling y'all stuff about other people, even like friends and stuff like that, mm-hmm. sometimes that may be miscued. Miscued and you can judge them, prejudge them mm-hmm. before from someone else's point of view before you get your own point of view. I'm mm-hmm. glad just like, I'm not like that for the most part. I try to at least get a chance <clears throat> to get to know them before. Like I have that in my mind. Like, yeah, I, I've heard that. But like, mm-hmm. is that true? Like I, I'm a curious person, right? So I guess I would want to know more by default because yeah. I'm I'm a curious person. So I guess right. that's the side I would probably choose. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But at the same time, even if you did tell me more beforehand, I'm not gonna go in and be like, oh, that person is that person, mm-hmm. like based off gotcha. of what you said. You gonna give them a chance to kind of show. Yeah, up like yourself. you were like Ross is a, a jerk. Da da da. I'm like, all right, let me go talk to Ross. No, Ross doesn't seem like a jerk to me. Right. <laughs> like that, I'm gonna get my own opinion off of that. You right. know, <laughs> like I'm not about to just be like, yeah, he's a jerk because he said. <clears throat> yeah, even nah. if you are like my brother or my my closest friends or mm-hmm. whatever, I still even with Keem, Theses, y'all, anybody that y'all can tell me this about somebody, I still want to know. Yeah, yeah. So. Unless he's just like your sworn enemy, then I'm like that dude. But yeah, 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 that's yeah, a size yeah, point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's that's that's. A I guess I gotta say, when I was younger, I used to be that gullible person that used to like. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, they are? And I used to believe them and I got on the side. Mm-hmm. You know, I think we all experienced that when we're like... Oh, yeah, like definitely yeah. in high school. I, 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 I was going to say yeah. high school. Younger, yeah. <laughs> even like a little bit after high school, like being around the wrong people, yeah. the wrong mm-hmm. crowd, it would like you would actually be that type of person because of the people mm-hmm. you're around. When they say that people you hang around can really be you... For sure. 
When I tell you that's so true, mm. it is. And mm-hmm. when you kind of like, mm. le- you, mm. <laughs> when you kind of leave those people alone, <laughs> mm. <laughs> you kind of leave those people alone. Look at you, real. Look, you know what? Preach. We're not doing that. Holy. So, like I said, when you kind, when you kind of leave those people alone, you start to do your own thing in life. You start to see. Where the wrong, where you went wrong. Do you, I think, do you I think around high school is when I started getting the mindset I had with the Facts. not judging. Like middle school, I think I, I I was similar in that sense. Like if I heard a rumor, I'd be like, oh, they definitely did that. Mm-hmm. Like in my head, I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, that person, that person. I, I'm over I was over. a late bloomer. So like I really didn't like, because it was funny because I was having a conversation with my mom. Like because I talk about how my daughter is and how like she's not like a friendly, friendly person. Mm-hmm. And I had to sit back and think. And my mom was like, you was like that. Like, Damn. I didn't have friends, like, until, like, I got in, like, eighth or ninth grade. Like, I didn't mm. have friends that, like, I hung out with. Like, you know, you have friends, you guys were younger, that y'all would spend the night at each other's house. Mm. I didn't experience mm. that I had until I was, like, maybe, on, I want to say ninth grade. I moved and, around a lot, so I, I really wasn't, like, I had people I talked to. I didn't have, like, buddy, buddy. Friends, not really until, like, late in high school. Yeah. So like so for, for me, I was kind of in that same boat. But like not, I could talk to anybody, but yeah. I, I I wasn't. I never considered people friends early because I had been backstabbed so early in life to the point where I was like, I didn't trust people early. I was gonna say I never even had that. I mean, that's what I'm saying. The backstabbing, all that stuff happened like during high school. That's why I, I it started. happened in high school too. But I mean, like I was still I had trust issues really early because I jumped around a lot. I was going through living with different people. Oh, okay, I get it. And so, like, I didn't trust anybody to begin with. So, you being called a friend really didn't happen until, like... Mm-hmm. Like, I had friends, but they weren't, like... People, I'm like, all right, let me go tell you something. Like, yeah. this yeah. I was I was pretty... Like, I was goofy and stuff, but I was to myself still. That's what I was. That's how I was. Like, I they was, didn't get a lot from I me. was to myself a lot, and I didn't really, like, even develop friendships. And gotcha. still, I got, like, in high... I didn't even open up to have, like... Trust and all that. I didn't care about none of that. I was just like, yeah, okay. Like I didn't even get like that until I got like. You don't know how mm. to kick them. <laughs> oh, y'all have a so so yes. great <laughs> conversation, but you kind of. So I want you to come in clear. You know what I'm saying? I come in very clear. All right. So gotcha. like I was saying, um, my thing. What is, does that mean? I don't even come in it's very provocative. Clear. Right. Gets the people. No, that's going. what your mind is. That's not what I'm saying. It was the saying that I was saying. <laughs> <laughs> She don't know the. Uh... She, she hasn't seen that movie. Oh, I'm getting off topic. We can talk about that. Later. Anyways, yeah. my, my point is, I didn't open myself up to that. So my when I got in high school, I was like, I want to say a late bloomer when it comes down to the friendship. So it made you feel like you were more gullible because of. So that. that's why it extended as long as, like I said, a mm-hmm. little bit. I want to say, I mean, me and him got together right after high school, so mm-hmm. it had to be like maybe a year. Locked her up. Like maybe a year after that, you know. Right. So like yeah. it took me time to like get over people, see how people were, and all the betrayed and all the people I hung around with they did so much stuff that it made me like gear away from that so my point of saying that while, was <clears throat> company you my keep point of saying that was you company, the company you keep will also balance who you are but I think <laughs> what, what Nisha thing was she was so she wanted to be loyal and she wanted to keep people that's me being because gullible of the, the, I was very gullible but you saw that it, in, in you all, wanted that friendship yeah I wanted that because so like, you wanted to see the good in people too and Like I didn't need it <laughs> I definitely had that. But you you wanted to see the good in people. Like yeah. I, 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 you know, I for like, sure can say I, I had that at one point. I wanted to see, but I also was still like, I don't know. Like I was, it's it's hard to explain that for me. Yeah, it's like, no, it is. I it's, had it's like tough. trust issues, but I also wanted to see the good in somebody. That's how you are. So, so like I would reach out for it and I'd be like, let me see if he's going to do something or if he's going to like, mm-hmm. I always had that thought in the back of my mind. So like mm-hmm. if they did it, I was like, oh. I told you. But you was already prepared in your mind. Yeah. yeah. It's like a damn, well, you know. <clears throat> well, I do that because I can, I don't like to cut people off. You have super trust issues. I, I don't either. Because I can really, it can be as if you don't exist. Like, I can look through, <laughs> I can go so, this is and crazy. people call it petty, but I can really just. It's crazy you say it because I just talked to Kess about this. I was like, I have, like, I'm a super friendly and like approachable person mm-hmm. now, but I have this. If I cut you you're off, just as the, you're just as much you the good don't as the, exist. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like you don't exactly. exist. And and Kess would be like, it's crazy because you can do that and you can make it look so easy. And I'm like, that's because I no longer like have you a part of my life. Like you, these are the people that I value. This is what I value. This is all the stuff that I value. You're out of it. Mm-hmm. Cool. This is what I value now. And mm-hmm. I that's just how my brain will work. And I'll, I'll compartmentalize it like that. You no longer exist. Yep. I'm good. 
and it won't bother me. I used to have trouble with that, but like, because I just recently broke a friendship that I had for almost almost twenty years, and it's like, damn, recently, it's like it's like ten or fifteen years. I don't think it was that long. Probably ten, fifteen years. We've been together for almost twelve. We've been together for twelve. How you twelve? I give you 13, 14. <laughs> this nigga here, bro. 14 now. Anyway. A long time. A long, a long time. time. Very long so, time. So, and it's like, for me, it Closer was, Mike. I thought it was going to be harder than what it is now. And like, I kind of like, I, the older I get, the more I don't really care. And it's like, I, and this, cause he has that, like where he can just, mm-hmm. and I used to always go, like, how do you do that? Like, how do you just cut somebody off and not get like, okay, next day, you yeah. know? But it's for me, now that I see that I'm getting older, I'm starting to see like, okay. Yeah. I understand. I got so much shit going on in life right now. It's like you start learning those there's people, chapters. That's why they don't exist because their, shit, their life just keeps going. Yeah. yeah. And it's like those people were never really there in the beginning. Bingo. And it's like you were there, but you weren't there. And now you're mm-hmm. seeing it now, mm-hmm. like with open mm-hmm. eyes. Yeah. So now you're like, wait a second, he didn't even matter to begin with. Like yeah. technically, yeah. he's just so much? he's literally <laughs> just a character in this chapter yeah. that's leaving after this chapter. Yeah. And that's, so and that's that, like, all right, cool. That's exactly how you do it because in my my routine is or what the reason why it's so what you would deem easy for lack of better terms is because yeah. I know I give you all of my energy mm-hmm. as a friend or as whatever we call ourselves. Bingo. I give you a thousand percent more. So once I realize that you taking, once it gets to a point, because it's not overnight. It's not one of them things where one mm-hmm. thing happens, unless you do something like so blatantly disrespectful out of line. Yeah. But it's one of them things where it has to be chance after chance. I agree. Me. Because once it gets there with me, then that's why it's easy for me to cut it off. Because it's like, bro, not only have I given you all of me as a person, but you've taken advantage of that, done me a certain type of way when I've given you all that I have, mm-hmm. I'm able to cut it off because exactly. I know I did my part. That's just like a person, yep. you know, excuse the example, but it's like when the person passes away, yeah. who's mm-hmm. usually crying the most and doing the most? The people that was in a bad situation with that person. Mm-hmm. The person that is usually the quietest is the one that they know that they're at peace because they know the relationship they had with the person. Yeah. yeah. You know, you're still gonna, yeah, you know, gonna be people twisted. grieve different. You're gonna yeah. grieve. But a lot of times, I'm talking about the ones that be doing that regularly. Yeah, the most. <laughs> yeah, most. Yeah, I got oh you. God, it's yes. because you just, you knew it's something you wish you could have gotten clarification on or you figured mm-hmm. out or, yeah. you know what I'm saying? And again, everybody grieves different. But from just my experience, seeing certain situations and incidents, that's usually the people, yeah. like the people that's good with the person usually have a more peaceful grieving and that's which, how I was which with can my still be. That's why I cried so much because I felt like there's a lot of stuff that I wanted to say to her that I couldn't. Yeah, because me and her weren't at the best terms when she yeah. passed away. That's fair. Yeah, and, and I, I mean, you that just was tough for me. and and you kind of you're able to kind of compartmentalize that, and you realize like, okay, so what it is with friendships is I'm giving everybody a bunch of me, and just like you and your ex friends, like I feel like you gave so much to people, yeah. but people were able to pick and choose when they wanted when to they be wanted to give life, back. Yeah, that's when true. they wanted to give back. Yeah, I'm telling you now, people, if you're in my life now. Like, realize it's because <laughs> it's really on some tick, 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 tick type stuff. You know, on the time it's ticking because people don't realize that I am being very weary of my peace, patience, and, and, and who comes into my space. Mm-hmm. Like, my space is going to be very selective coming soon. I, you know, because... I tell, I'm sorry to cut y'all, but I tell Kess this all the time. Protect your energy. I tell her to protect your, your energy space. all the time, and especially in your space. Because people will come in and try to use every bit of you, especially like she knows how I am. I'm such a like loyalty is so important to me. So like she knows when I get invested or cool with people, she knows I'm going to give them whatever. Like I'll if they call me for this, I'm there. Like I'm going to do that. Like she was like, oh, you just go. You just go get up and go help them move right now. I'm like, it's it's, it's such a time in in the morning. I'm like, they asked me to help. And so like because that's just me. Fact. And so That's if I'm giving I'm, you all this and then eventually something happens to where we, we end up cutting off, it's for a very, very good reason. Yeah. It's for, like he said, like a buildup of things because she knows she she's she's sitting there watching all these all everything I'm doing during this period. She knows I am like dying to help this person your partner when I don't that. have to. Your partner sees and, that. and she's seeing it. She's like, yeah, he deserved it. Like, like at yeah. that point, she's like, oh, yeah, he needs to be cut off if yeah. you're cutting him off. Yeah, and, that, yeah. and that's when Nisha, Nisha see me do things and she'll be like, man, you do this and this and this and this person still. And then so mm-hmm. she starts to realize now why I can do it. 
because it's like I give my energy. I give a thousand percent energy to people. So sometimes same, I tell you stuff and you still go back and do. Yeah, and I still, <laughs> still. but I still will do. Just like recent situations with people, I'll still figure out a way to make something work. There's nothing wrong with that, but you know, you always you have too. to have. Uh, that's all I said. It's nothing wrong with that. No, but, it's not. It, but, but that's you the have point. to have that. You know, the, but y'all still end up feeling the way I said y'all was gonna feel. So it's like, why? Because I'm like, y'all, I tell y'all both, I'm like, y'all do this to people, y'all help each other, y'all help people, which is amazing. Cause I'm a person that loves, help. so y'all may hear this as, oh, she don't like to be there for people. That's not true. I go above and beyond. I'm, for people. That. Just, I'm just saying, people may yeah. hear it by me so, telling y'all to stop doing that, but it's the reason why I'm telling y'all that. Yeah, people can see. will take advantage of you. And y'all both have been taken advantage of to mm-hmm. a top tier. Yeah, for sure. And at some point, you're going to have to be like, you know what? I can't. For sure. But, but it but usually takes someone from the outside yeah, to that's, tell that's you saying outside it. Saying to see it. And not to say that you don't see it, but it usually takes that extra reinforcement mm-hmm. to be like, hey, th- this is this is where it's... This is what the signs are. We've been down this road before. I know you're trying to help this person out. But sometimes they got to help themselves. And that's because right? sure. we're seeing the best in that of person course. a lot of times, especially you like. I don't want to see it like that. And that's ca- what I was telling Nisha yeah. mm-hmm. about uh, her friend. Like, for sure. You know, great can be a great person, has a lot of potential. But at the end of the day, don't I don't hear no calls like, how you doing? Yeah. Are you OK? Nope. You just had a child. Don't even know what you had to do. Like on that type of stuff, I'm able to easily throw you off. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like. Not once was I considered in your life. Mm-mm. Yeah. Like I'm Nisha the type of person that's thinking about people more than her own situation. Mm-hmm. She has to have four children now to make sure she maintained a husband, a household, you know, yeah. <clears throat> you know, um, house and, and, and career and everything else that we have going on. But you're not going to call to see him. I'm all right. But here I am always considering to make sure you straight. That's okay. Just because you yeah. want to turn up all the time and all that. That's mm-hmm. fine. I don't. I've still not judged you on that. Ross go out all the time. I'll tell him not to go out on the sense of like looking out for him in certain situations. If that's what he's doing, he knows what he's doing. He's a grown man. Mm -hmm. He know where I come from is a, it comes from a place of love. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you not finna, you know what I'm saying? Consider what you got going more than me. than I'm being thinking about what your situation is. And you're not Mm -hmm. even considering what I'm going through. And every time you call me, you just, Putting me packing on more. Oh, yeah. bro, it's going on. Yeah. It's going on. Yeah. And it's going on. And it's going on. Every time I hear from you, once every yeah. five, six, seven months. Mm-hmm. And then I expect me and you to still be cool yeah. for years to like I'm not your punching bag when it's time for you to come lay it on somebody. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, yeah. bro, I'm not your getting, therapist. Bro, like fam, like understand <laughs> I'm going through something too. Therapist. But that's not even this one friend. It's a lot of people. It's a lot that do of them that. that do that. You know, even ex friends that used to be cool, and it's mm-hmm. like certain people y'all don't see us around with around anymore. It's like that's the same thing that's going on. Like I just need to call you to to just get this off my chest. Well, damn, I'm going through something too. Mm-hmm. I, you know what I'm saying? Like I can't just hear your problems all day before you even say, "Hey, how you even freaking doing?" Yeah, people right. hit you, man. Guess what? Uh, it's like, well, damn. Hello, all right. Uh, well, you doing okay? Uh, I'm okay. <laughs> you hear the baby crying, the kids in the background arguing, but you just ready to give your shit off. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You just ready to get your shit off. Right. Like, bro, everybody got problems. So it's like you gotta people gotta stop being one dimensional in one way with their energy as far as friendships. Mm-hmm. That's why it's easy for me to just click because it wasn't at one point. Mm-hmm. I had to learn, even with friends now, like, bro, I'm, hey, fam. When when it gets I'm dead ass. Like in a, in some time. If my kids don't even know your name, that's going to let you know where we are. Yeah. When it get to a certain point, yeah. I don't want nobody coming to me. Man, you don't. Uh, come here, Mariah. <laughs> you the oldest. So I'm going to nah, just. She gonna be like, what's yeah. his name? <laughs> and if it ain't no joke or if I ain't no see you or nothing, that's why, fam. <laughs> Don't ask me nothing next, because I don't act like that towards people. Right. Mm-hmm. If I know I ain't hitting you up, I know I people live in it. If I ain't hitting you up, I know something. You live in it and you yeah. got stuff going on. I ain't finna go meet you. We don't I just don't hear from you. <laughs> I'm definitely not about to do what? that. Yeah, bro. <laughs> bro, we all trying we to understand. We trying to maintain, God damn it. Everybody Niggas got do that though. lives, kids doing And I don't get mad at that. Like, if that's what the situation is, that's just what it is. Mm-hmm. But you will make time. For what, what you, you want to make time, time for. Absolutely. Jeez. And I'm not quote, a hypocrite. I want to get a shirt with that quote. That quote is so important. It's so, it's like. That it, did knock it people hits, out. 
family, it hits friends. Because it works for everything. Everybody, <laughs> everything. Equal opportunity. Yes. Like, you will make time for what you want to make Because you're going to be like, oh, I have, to do, well, I have to work so late. And next thing you know, you see them on Instagram going out. And as live as social Same media people. is... <laughs> Social media really it does. magnifies it tells on you how time. much people it will tell how much people you bullshit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It'll show you the bullshit in people. Mm-hmm. People will sit in there and they'll ask for some cash and then just be then bought a new Ooh, fit or God. something. Woo! Right? You got the newest Jordans on. And you broke. <sighs> what? I'm just. It's how? not even that because we can go as far as like it's like a it's slap for all in your the dogs. Face. <laughs> It's like a dogs. slap in your face Wick when man. they sit there and ask you for change or money, and you sit there and be like, and they post it on Instagram that they bought something just twenty. They got the nerve to turn their lip up at you when you be like, mm-hmm. yep. Why are you asking for money now, bro? My my one word for twenty twenty two and twenty twenty three was no, nope. 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 How Michael Kyle used to say, no, eh, no, hell no, no. Mm-mm. I ain't had no more, much more peace in my life since the word no entered into the chat. It is, it is it's definitely uh, a peacemaker. Even in the moving, like uh, you the homie and everybody the people, because I agree with you on a lot of things, but on moving, no. oh no. Nah. Hell no. <laughs> 30. Well, I said well, once I turn 30. Number. It depends on who you are now. For me, I'm, right. I'm very selective Man, now. No, that to... moving itself is a no. Like you no, this, this, I just, work for FedEx. I'll good. be all right. Yeah, you good. Yeah, you need help. I got you. It's just a personal. <laughs> I have personal reasons because I moved all my life and Hell I've been yeah. moving since. That's I was fair. Two. Hey, like just hey, that's everywhere fair. and helping people. I moved people. a lot. So all right, I moved a I lot too. Told people. I'm with you. Once I, I hit thirty, I said, "Yeah, I'm good." Mm-hmm. I moved a lot, but you know, if you you need a hand and you moving yeah. out your house, you real. I got you. You real. I'm sure we'll see you to move a number. <laughs> I'm just not. I'm, I'm cool. I'm I feel good. like we're in our 30s now. We got bones we're going to break. So That ain't that. It's, I gonna, wouldn't even ask you to come help me. To be honest with you, I'm not even the type to ask you to come help me uh, move unless I know for sure you're going to come help me move. So oh, that's I'm pretty confident. Like I'm like, all right, this person going to help me move. All right, cool. I ask them. If it's a rigorous situation. Yeah. And, like, and most of the time, really I'm not trying mean, to get you to do that we'll, much we'll anyway. Yeah. Yeah. You know. That's me. I'm, like, I'm not. All of y'all. <laughs> He yeah, said bro. it's a no for me. It's a no, man. Yeah, nah, I, ain't I, don't, I ain't tripping on that. I mean, we haven't even moved ourselves. And like the last two times we moved, we got movers. Yeah, that's fair. Because I we just can't. Yeah, I, can't. I feel it. <laughs> Tired of doing pizza parties on. Uh, I don't think I've ever had a mover before. <laughs> oh, bro. Really? Ross introduced me to. Um, yeah, I'm about the to last say, one. We... He sure got. He, that's why he over there quiet because he know he. That don't make no this. damn sense. Tell me. <laughs> I'm talking about this nigga move. <laughs> that was a big ass truck. Nah, this I, nigga move. Like from I got room. the U-Haul. Like I rented the U-Haul and everything. And I was, nigga Ross moved from a Shit, room. We ain't did that since like 2014. But I had my bed and stuff in there. I man. ain't moved yeah. since. I ain't moved. Moved since. I had my bed. Steve. I had my bed. Probably that. We not magnifying table. this. So I'm sorry. I had this nigga moved my... from a room. Yeah. He got movers. Yes. That's if that ain't bougie, I don't know what from, from a room to what? From a room. To his apartment. To right? his apartment. Yeah. yeah. That ain't one time. I mean but yeah, that if you got that much stuff. <laughs> I don't even want to miss credit home. If you got that much town stuff. Home. Sorry, I hit town yeah, there's home. There's an HOA and everything, yeah. If, if you got that much stuff. <laughs> no, it is. I didn't say it was. Well, right? We already man, you corrected the, it. You the ain't gotta I'm, keep I'm, sitting I'm, on the point I'm not trying to shit on y'all. The point I'm trying to make sure y'all understand that there's no extra bouginess to it. It's just for the simple fact that Time is on the essence, and I ain't got time to be trying to ask everybody on some, hey, can you help me move when I actually had the funds to go ahead to. and do you it? You could just got a little, the smallest U-Haul truck and nah, put your bed in just there. get some movers. Ain't nobody trying to move no bed by themselves, though. Those I ain't doing that. I mean, I would help you move the bed. I was 20-something then. Uh, uh, <laughs> I really was. Bro, you, you first, was we had to go to the because uh, we had our stuff in storage too, so they had to go there get all the extra stuff that I plan on taking. I would have helped you to do that, bro. Come on, bro. That, that's like two, three man job. I definitely would have helped. Yeah, bro. And we was in our twenties, fresh. Man, I'm, I'm dead. You on, keep bro. saying in your twenties. So what I'm about not now? about to. I'm do telling that. you now. I'm not. I'm not. I'm this guy. That's just the one thing I do. Everything else, yeah, like you do. I can have my one thing, right? Yeah. That's fair. I'm not helping you move. That is one hundred percent okay. Not. There's some things yeah, I will not help people do. I'll hire the mover for you if you if I yeah. mess with you like that. Yeah, yeah man. You know, so I don't think that's a bougie. That's no, real. Like don't if you pay piggyback for the on my. Hey, nah, I'd happily like take that. Huh? No, you want to hire a mover for me? Go ahead. 
Yeah, we got the homie that. That'd uh, be the first time I had a mover do my work ever. He always frown. <laughs> that guy that the number you gave us to get it when we moved into the house. Yeah, the dude. What about him? We we was just saying that if we didn't move, but we got the this guy. He was pointing at you because you gave hey, us the number. Hey, no, well, no, um, my dad had a mover, but I mean, I'm talking about me by myself. Nah, I've never had a mover. I just don't think it's that bougie. In my situation, I think we could. It's it's bougie. Now that we're older, that was like a two like three it's man. Not bougie at all. Like, I don't think. No, I'm talking bougie. about. We could have. Well, he said it's a two three man job, no, bro. That was a bro. bed and some shoes. No, it wasn't a bed and some shoes. It was actually a bed, desk, then a, a diner table, then all the shoes because they wasn't just a amount, small amount. My bad. Then there was oh, extra clothes. Yeah, there was a decent His amount. Shoes took up half of the, the yeah. truck. It actually did. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder what it's gonna be like moving now. Right. I'm definitely gonna have to get in the mood. Well, That's you live in a you live in a townhome now, so oh, you can yeah, don't that's air quote. Well, I'm air quote because I was correcting cold, the, the apartment apartment term <laughs> earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fair. So townhome, no air quote. Let me go back. Let me go backwards. <laughs> to unquote. Yeah, unquote. Unquote it, man. Unquote it, man. In the townhome. Really, just unquote it. Unquote it. I ain't never seen that before in my life. I'm about to do that. Now. That was funny. I'm gonna use that. Right. Yeah, unquote it. <laughs> But for real, now it makes sense because you're coming from a townhome to, you know, this little house. mansion or whatever you're that you're trying to pop. I'm speaking into existence. Okay. Speaking of mansion. Would you get a mansion? Nah. Not for myself. By yourself is pretty ridiculous. Well, yeah, that's yeah, I guess that, that'd be tough. Yeah. By yourself. I guess what, what do you, what do you call family, mansion? You get the little Rosses. What's a mansion? You get a mansion. <laughs> square footage. What's a mansion to y'all square foot wise? Uh, I got some pictures. Like 4,000 square taking pictures foot? Of these I houses. Like you know the square footage? I don't know the square footage. 4,000 pictures. 4,000 square foot. Really? Oh, look at that. That's the dog I seen yesterday. Oh, that's tough. Yeah, no, nah, that's not home, tough. That's one of the <laughs> that's you don't not think 4,000 square feet? At least it's at a gate. It's a mansion? Exactly. Put it at the gate. 4,000 square feet? I don't think that's a mansion. Ours is 34 square feet. Take it easy. Take it easy. Feet. Take it easy. Putting too much info. <laughs> that one right there. Yeah, that's tough. That one there. That one there. What side of town? North? It's Richmond. That's Richmond. Yeah. Rich what? I'm just playing. <laughs> oh, the movie. Carter, yeah. <laughs> I, I caught I've it been immediately. Waiting that. <laughs> Richwood, he's stupid. But yeah, um, so four thousand square feet. Yeah. I mean, that's a lot of space, though. That is nah, that a lot is of house. A, that is a lot. You of got space, wings bro. now. Damn, Warren, how big was a mansion to you then? If that's not big, you got wings now. Five, people, six, people, six, seven, people yeah, think six, our seven. house is big, and we don't think it's big. I, first of all, God, I do. <laughs> yeah, <First of laughs> he all, said. Actually, I, never I said do that. think my house is big. Um, <laughs> we just got used to it. So, you know, when you're living somewhere for some years, you accumulate the yeah. space ain't the space no more. Yeah. So yeah. it's still, you know, large. But mansion, I'm thinking like seven, eight thousand. Damn. That's a damn. What is, a state. Right? That's a warehouse. Fam, I want to be able to. <laughs> I want a court. Like seven thousand. You know, they have the courts floors. in these houses. That's what that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Not think, but, they be but having courts, pools. My budget wise, probably five. My budget was four or five because <laughs> so we ride at four, so, so I can park about my, four or five Porsche <laughs> on the cool. Yeah, I want to drive, like, yeah, I no, wouldn't uh, even get a Porsche right now because I want to <laughs> yeah, connect it to the house. Like, they, on the side, yeah. I delivered to one of those the mm-hmm. other day. Dude had the uh garage right the here, the garage you go underneath, mm-hmm. and you got the, the three car garage in front. Yeah. Connected to the house. Yeah. I'm gonna want like them seven, eight car garages where you can go in. Okay, now you're getting ridiculous. Not for real, bro. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, uh, you, know you, hey you, you like what you like though. Uh, it sound bougie, but you seen it, it before. Sound bougie. You seen it before with a guy walking in. It just in. sound bougie. See, you walk in the and the dude one. cut the light on, and then the lights cut on, and then they have like yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, bougie. <laughs> what the hell? Thank seven, you. eight. He's a part of the club. I delivered the mansion because you can they do, ain't got you no can do seven more stuff eights. in the garage. I want to put a weight. Room. Boy, you tripping? <laughs> I want to put a weight room on half of it. Yeah, okay. You see what I'm saying? You gonna have a weight room already in the house? We already got a couple cars. I so. told y'all, man. <laughs> I'm not the only one, and I'm not our, mad at it. Ross, if you were if you were married with kids, your ass would have a huge want to have a huge ass house too. Not a huge house, Ross. I don't, Depends on the kids. Your, the amount of kids. your damn shoes will take up one room. That matters. Course, enough kids. They, uh, they don't Thank need you. You, you got enough kids, I got for, enough it. kids for it. Yeah. He they does. got their own car section too. Yeah. Ready for? <laughs> 
Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. hey, hey no, nah, we giving them cars now. Yeah. It's over. Yeah. You got what four? Yeah. Yeah. That's four. Nah, four. Let them ride in the two. Porsche. That for you actually would probably need a seven to eight. That would be a good good size for you. Well, that's if they gonna stay. We don't want. No, 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 no. We don't want. We talking high school. We talking. We talking high school now. Come on, they got their high school slots. I like, y'all so funny. I've been on this wave. <laughs> Get on the bus. So wait, I've been on this wave, y'all, where I've been watching uh I've been watching these like black family movies, right? Like as far as like I mean little racist, like, but all right, go ahead. No, I mean They are not about the yellow bus, watch. That it's not about that. It's about them like not, they all work they all have a business, they work they all live together. Like I meant to say, like for instance, when you talked about how oh, well, I ain't trying to get this thing, you know. My thing is they're all like at that age Thank and they you. all still live with the parents. Oh, okay. But gotcha. they live in a big Huge house. That's what's gonna happen. And I said that. I was gonna say yeah, that's, that's what's gonna, gonna happen. happen. You know how many incomes are coming in? Bro. Exactly. Yeah. Like that we, I love that idea. I, man, hello. We've been we've been trying. We me and Warren were trying to do that. Whoa, whoa. All right. Do, <laughs> this is a too much pod. But like, it's too, way too much. Way gonna, too you know. need to cut it. <laughs> cut it out, yeah, pod. The family just listen to this pod for some reason. reason this yeah, one, this is only the one. 97 for some reason. So, like that number. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all this shit. All this shit. Girl, I got 90 other pods you ain't never heard. All Thanksgiving week. So, yeah. you know, oh, y'all, watch y'all latest pod. Y'all watch that Thanksgiving yeah, pod. This, what about that uh, seven Thursday. to eight car garage hey, you was talking if about? If it's meant, it's meant. Stand on business. Stand, so on, like it. Stand, stand on, on business. Business. Stand on business. Stand on business. Stand on Thanksgiving. But you're right. We, ch- we did try to Because I just like, had a conversation saying I don't mind. We did try to have a, a, a thing where family, like that was my ideal yeah, before I bought a house was to try house, to that was get like plan. a huge enough house to where multiple people can stay. I think about that a lot. We can, sh- you know, yeah, you always cool got a babysitter. Too. We had you our realtor, got, everybody like, pitch in. We had her going to go find those houses that have houses inside of them, like well, duplicate houses, like, mm-hmm. you know. Um, multi-family multi-family homes. pretty much well we had our own living room we had our own game room our own space and they had their own space too they were live and they were like at that time that's when uh the interest rates were low before covid before covid and we found some deals and we were like because we were about to look at one and yeah we bought our house in covid 2020 yeah so basically it was like we we're telling them like hey you know we're in the midst of buying this and we're like okay we can get this house we can get because they were pretty much all the same price just saying that. So mm-hmm. we could have got that, but you know, family is family. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. Everybody have a different idea yeah. of what they want. For sure. I just wish, you know, because I, I always think about like, man, just imagine if everybody come, come together. together. Income. How much money is And then y'all stacking. had your own. Damn. The thing is, they had their own separate space. So it yeah. wasn't like we were intruding. Not even on top of each other. Like, of each it other. was yeah. so live. Like, it would have been lit. It yeah. still can Because we would have had an in-house no, sitter. It still can be. <laughs> it still can be. Whatever they want to. Well, anybody does. Sounds like, like we're so, just gonna have to all move together. Ugh, that would be Let's do it. I remember when uh, YouTube thought me and Ross had a uh, house. Yeah, yeah, had a YouTube house. I thought they were bachelors. Oh, no, that was his house. One of them YouTube <laughs> houses. It was an apartment because remember we was recording at my apartment at the time, mm-hmm. and uh, yeah, he was trying to come. I ain't gonna say no. Oh names, you know? yeah, I remember that. Yeah. <clears throat> kind of rubbed me the wrong way when homie was like, uh, <laughs> "Yeah, man, we can record or whatever," which I was cool with. And then after that, he was just like, um. Yeah, man, it's kind of expensive out there too down there, and I think Rock, you were messaging him, mm-hmm. and uh, he was like, "Yeah, um, yeah, I probably you know see if I could crash too after." And he, I was like, "No, nope. whoa, yeah, nah, well, that's a no, dog. I don't know you like that." Catch you a hotel? There's some couple of hotels now here. You know Bro, Chisel done been out here two times. Yeah, he ain't never asked. Hey, man, uh, you mind if I, you know, crash on the couch? <laughs> Bro, Chisel be doing his own thing, bro. He, he really do. He yeah. got his own setup. He yeah. know where he going. He got an itinerary. Come kick it with us. Now, if we doing something, invite him. He pulling up. You know what I'm saying? Like following us, or we send him an address, but. Yeah, that, that very first time, I was just like, nah. Mm-hmm. I said, if this is what it's going to be like collabing with people, nah, then man. I don't want it. You know, because I, I don't like, want it. Yeah, I said, you know. But shout out to home. I don't yeah. know, hope mm-hmm. doing well. But <laughs> I was like, nah, you couldn't, couldn't do that. But nah, this has been a, a very I dope. I couldn't either. <laughs> yeah, nah. You know, I'm like, my kids here, man. I can't. Yeah, nah. Yeah, no. Just because you make videos. Don't Definitely mean, no. Yeah. Even if we knew him for a long time, I don't. Definitely no. Mm-mm. I don't trust everybody in my house. I, <laughs> Absolutely I, I, I even not. tell people that my sister, whoever's dating, don't bring them to my house. Oh, we oh we the same way. No. Like, <laughs> Very yeah. selective. It, it, it's serious. They know me. Oh. Like, don't even oh, ask. Yeah. I mean, oh, but I'm. No, and, no we're, that, we're right no. there with you. And I'm the same way. They mm-hmm. probably don't see that side of me a lot, but it's like, you know. 
I don't do the niggas. <laughs> yeah. I 1000% agree. Do the niggas, bro. <laughs> I, I don't I don't think I, mean, I can agree want, more. Like I want let me meet you at a restaurant or meet you outside or maybe at their damn house. 100%. I can meet you there. We can but meet down the street. Don't have them come to my house and we can meet. Yeah, no. I don't do the niggas cuz I don't I don't think <laughs> I don't I don't think twice. I don't ask questions. Mm-hmm. I'm not one of them niggas you're going to be like, oh, bro, he should have. No, nah, nigga. Oops. <laughs> oh, 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 what? Oh, damn. You oh, wasn't supposed to be here. I ain't even. I was going to say, damn, you get the little backpack. Hey. I ain't getting nothing. It's going to be right there. <laughs> Handy dandy. <laughs> what you doing here? Backpack, backpack. <laughs> backpack, backpack. Sit on him with thinking to think. So. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be so funny, y'all, because Warren no don't go guesser. nowhere What'd you say? without his <laughs> what, what? his friend is always with him. Backpack, backpack, <laughs> backpack, backpack. Yeah. You start looking if a car follow me, on if me. a car follow me too long. Oh, like, oh, oh, me too. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Give my backpack. Backpack, <laughs> backpack. <laughs> I need the map. It's sad that now you really have to do that in this world. Like you have to make sure that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ain't nobody gonna fight I no told more. him, I said, look, I no, need, the people, I need people mine too. No we need to. Yeah, I don't, yeah I don't we about to get our his and hers. Yeah, for all sure. All together. Edition. Oh. Gonna have the kids tuned up too. <laughs> oh, for sure. Yeah, you damn skippy. I seen that movie shit that yeah. what I've been watching. And they got, they train the kids, yo. Oh, for sure. I oh, know. We, we, we training ours It too. ain't the same. Boxing. It's not the same. <laughs> yeah, hang that up, bro. <laughs> yeah, we're doing crop. Well, let the, that go. The gun side of crop go. Yeah, because <laughs> yeah. they have like no, gun facts. training and everything. So, dog, we yeah, are no. in that thing. Mm-hmm. Kapow. Yeah, that's you feel where I agree. That's and why I'm like, I don't I'm not condone even it at all. I wish we didn't even have to, because I didn't even yeah. grow up in the house with that. Yeah, because we don't want that. But you know, I just see my dad fighting all the time. But if you could imagine him in this day and age, yes, yeah, not. It would have probably been a different situation because nope. you beat somebody up or whatever. They, oh, all right. Hey, yo, right. bro, what I'm you, about to go to my drunk. Yeah, 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 nah, it's yeah, you can hang that up. You can't Every time swing on those, like you can't no. fight. You at can't all. have beef now. Boys can't get embarrassed no more. Yeah, and that's the thing. They can't can't, can't get, get embarrassed. embarrassed no more. Like it, for always... instance, my friend that just passed away, the one that I was cool with in high school, mm-hmm. he, he got into Worst a fight. Yeah, he got into a fight at the show ride. Fist fight. What a dude. The dude got mad, lost, came back with a gun, shot him. Now he's dead. Every time. Yep. Yeah, that's that is sad, but that's, that's the, the reality. They, now. Thank God they finally found him, and he just was arrested. If you walk week. away from me fast. Oh, I'm walking away too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We gone. But they had a party though, so he thinking, okay, I just had a squad. Oh no, 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 no. I'm about to go back and chill. Oh, I gotta move around. Yeah, you got And you hate that situation, man, because if we just can't have a dispute or a disagreement, we both go home. Whatever it is, we fought it out. We boxed it out. I mean, that's just what we grew up on. Yeah. Yes. All right, bro, let's box this out real quick. Get this off. You win, I win. Whatever it is, shake hands or we don't. Whatever, but we both get to go home. Nowadays, like you said, people get embarrassed because they in the crowd and it's like, nah, nah, I gotta get my, I gotta yeah, get everybody them recording it too. So that don't. And help. then I was just saying this earlier. It is something in jail, bro. I don't know what they selling. They got some cookies or something. That's people want to be there. Addicted, bro. Niggas, they dying to be there. Damn, yeah. niggas is going to jail. And we got to end this, but it's niggas that, that be, you know, them people that be like, yeah, I, I hit us. You a dumbass. <laughs> Absolute dumbass. Yeah. I'm a shooter. You a worker ant. That's yeah. what you a are. A worker ant? Yes. I'm a shooter. Bro, okay. imagine, imagine that, I'm proud bro. of you. I'm proud of you for being the shooter. Yeah, I got my shooters. What? You go handle it your damn self. The crash You going to go send another nigga Absolute crash to go in his life. Yeah. Over something you beefing with another The other dude going to end his life to end his own life yeah. by going to jail. Yeah, that's stupid. <laughs> and yeah. niggas really be out here parading that. And yeah. they be proud to be that guy for that mm-hmm. other guy. And people, now yeah, sh- they people, doing time for that guy. And that guy ain't even men, checking on you now. Bro, yeah. people fear men because of how much other niggas are going to do something for them. Not because yeah. that man going to come and see you himself. Nope. Yeah. They don't do that no it's more. It's the day and age we live in. Yeah. Soft. Right. Sounds about right, man. Soft. They got, like, the mobs and stuff. They had, they hit us, they had, they shoot us. Yeah. That's that's just what it is, except niggas get caught easily. Because, you know, niggas got to tell everything they do. And now it's completely <laughs> different. Like, back then when they was doing it, because I'll be watching my documentaries. Now, fam, you can't even cross a red light or a toll. Oh, yeah. Without them seeing you yeah, nah. eating a cheeseburger as yeah, you drive, nah. like bro, they got you in. <laughs> <laughs> That's so true. Commit, commit, commit. Niggas commit. got you in ten k. 
I had to just <laughs> rob somebody, shot somebody, you got hungry. Right. This nigga stopped a Whataburger. Yeah, we see you here. You stopped at Whataburger off Hillcroft. <laughs> nigga still got some fucking <laughs> mustard and mayonnaise on the no. beard and shit. Hey, with me, I ain't, I ain't do that. We, we know, sir. Nigga fucking the, the damn residue. Yeah, it's like grease residue. <laughs> nigga, we know, bro. You had the triple B, triple cheese, bro. It's, Dummy. It's, it's, it's in bro. your receipt. That's, that's your last great meal. Your receipt You're going to date on it. For the rest of your life. Nigga <laughs> went down with a triple meat. <laughs> Pause. <laughs> damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's funny, but it, bro, that's how niggas get caught. Because we do everything on social media, and there's cameras everywhere. They can find you. They can track your phone. They can do all types of things. And people just be like, so surprised when this shit happens. <laughs> oh, it wasn't me. Oh man, you got the wrong guy. And oh, we caught man. the nigga. On, we got on. you on video, my boy. <laughs> Full <laughs> face. You actually went live after it. Yeah, I got that nigga. <laughs> Wait, what? Case closed, Johnson. What did you do exactly? I shot him. <laughs> On live. Niggas in the, in the chat and, you know, niggas what did you do? What you do? What you do? Bro, they be like, you ain't, what, what you mean? What you mean? Who you trying got? To get him Who to you talk? got? Man, you lying. That's Cap. And once a nigga say it's Cap, oh, oh, it ain't Cap. I'll show you. Ah. I'll show you the proof. He gonna go, go right here. Right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nigga, yeah. Once it's missing a, nigga a bullet. Just a dumbass. Just a dumbass. It's over because the nigga pride gonna get in the way. Nah, I'll show you. I'm really that nigga. I've seen the footage <laughs> of niggas self-incriminating themselves. FBI self. all over this, my boy. And just watching, bro. They got the easiest job now, bro. FBI ain't even got to work no more. Appreciate y'all. Let me get what? that video. Just, run that video off. I'm just it's the look police. at your Instagram. Look at this dumbass. That's lit. They have a division and they people know this. And they Social know media niggas that got locked up from it. And they still be like, speaking I, of, I ain't never gonna get caught. So you know, you know how they talked about how Young Thug situation, where now they're approved to mm -hmm. use his lyrics. That's yep. cold. Yeah, I was like, damn, it's bound to happen. They no, nah, they're but trying they, to get. They, they fought they it really, for a long trying. time, though. They did. Yeah. They always, they always end it up went trying on to fight for a while, the, the they lyrics. Finally just because in other it. cases they weren't, they didn't, yeah. they weren't able to. Yeah. So mm -hmm. they, really they were trying to do it to Melly. Yeah, for Melly's case too. But they, they couldn't. Yeah, but not he, not him. They trying to get him. Oh, no, they, they, they trying to throw him under the. But dirt. I think that it's he's gonna he's gonna they got. Yeah, yeah he's, he's they got gonna. something on him for them to be that persistent. They they showed the footage of all the, the lines and bars of all the slatting and all the all that shit. And I'm it's like, like he shot somebody, so, mom. Yeah, bro. And then it's like it's one, and the thing is, rappers do this. Same thing we saw with King Von, bro. Constantly. Like this. You know, they will talk about stuff, stuff that they've they done. Did, they got to yeah. brag about it. And then it becomes a hit song. And the thing is, people blow. Like, oh, it's just lyrics. That's pretty real. Mm. It's a pretty real line. It, it, it's more than just lyrics. And if not the to cops, that person's family or whoever they yeah. did What's that boy's name? Or not, or well, he's not a boy, but he's a young man Um, that's in jail right now for murder. The one that had uh, that song went viral. Millie? No, you talking, oh, talking about take K. No, take K. Oh yeah, yeah. That that song was kind of hard. But I ain't beat the gate. Bitch, I did the race. And everybody, what, song? what was the song? The race. That, the song. It was the race. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Everybody was playing it. It was it was no. crazy. The beat yeah. was hard. As the beat hell. went hard. Yes. Yeah, like, the beat. I mean, was he ain't hard. really talking about nothing I care about, but the yeah. beat hard. The yeah. beat was hard. RP to the victim. <laughs> that was very very insensitive. First of to all, to rock out. I don't think he was I mean, the we one that a lot knew, of Nobody talks. knew that it was a real thing. Like, we thought he was what? Well, actually, rapping. no, people did know. Uh, yeah, people, a lot of people yeah, knew, but knew. we, oh, we, we, didn't we, didn't know. Know. we didn't know. Hey, we're innocent yeah. in this. We, we listened to it like, this is a nice, trendy song. I feel bad about hitting the nay-nay now. <laughs> oh, yeah, because he hit that whip. Yeah, yeah. Hit that nay-nay. Wait, what happened with him? Oh, yeah. He killed his uncle or something like that. What the hell? He in jail. Yeah, he in jail. What is wrong with these people, What is all these rappers? And he on. had the happiest song. They had it on Nickelodeon. Yeah, he was whipping kids. the Nene, and yeah. now he's shooting people. That yeah. is insane. He was whipping it. Damn. <laughs> he was whipping out the Nene. Yeah, for but real. Uh, rest in peace to yeah. I think he was. His I didn't either. Yeah, nah, nah, yeah. yeah. So are you whipping the Nene? I don't even think they play it. I'm gonna no say, I'm, yeah, I haven't heard mm -hmm. that song in a while. Yeah, because yeah, niggas be out here wilding. Yep, like for real, for real. So yeah, be careful out there in the streets, man. It's 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 a random time, and it's getting the holidays too. Yeah, yep. you know what I'm saying. So be mindful of your surroundings. Niggas always got tricks to start work early. on stealing instead just of working at a job. Car. Huh? <laughs> just stole my boy car. So. Oh, for real? Mm -hmm. Keep, yep. Damn, for real? Mm -hmm. that, uh, when did that happen? Recently? Like a few days ago. Wait, really? <clears throat> Damn. At his crib? <gasps> oh, 
that sucks. Damn, man, that's, that's fucked up, bro. Yep, holidays. Yeah, it's holidays, bro. Yeah, my mom said that uh, it was some stuff going on in the news, like they're following people now. From that, because you know, around this time they get stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're somebody they're following the, from the AT, like they'll they'll yeah, watch yeah, they've you. They've been doing that, so, so like, they doing let's it even just more say, now. Yeah, like it's been a lot more heavier. <clears throat> so like this lady was at Kroger's, and you know how they have like a bank there. I think it was like Bank mm-hmm. of America or somewhere Wells Fargo. Don't Inside get me if I'm wrong. Yeah. And basically, somebody pulled up. It was during daytime. Somebody pulled up to there, pulled out some money. They were in the parking lot as if they were a customer, sitting in the car watching them from like a little distance, and. Followed them home. Damn. The, the person put the money in their purse, all that. They was walking in the house and they pulled up with rifles behind them and robbed them and brought them. Rifles? Yeah. Damn, bro. Good I'm Lord. telling you now. <laughs> and that's why, like, because Warren always tells me, hey, don't go to 18 by yourself. Like, he, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Don't go to 18 by yourself. Like, yeah. Don't go at Especially night. Especially right now, don't, it's don't not. Put, put gas in the car at night. Yeah, don't so, go to ATM. Like, I, don't yeah. even, I don't even like kids pumping gas anyways most yeah. of the time, yeah. so. So it's crazy because I need gas right now too. (laughs) Always. But it's, you know, he's here. So you good. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But, you know, they had to catch me. (laughs) Damn, this nigga drive faster. (laughs) On E2. (laughs) Oh, please. Until I can't go nowhere. You You have to catch me. Why you be smart? Just drive to the police station. For sure. Yeah. They're going to have to catch me. Well, they I, ain't going to stop at no police station. They're going to be like, ah, oh, shit. But <laughs> that's why I do going? like when I, I would mm-hmm. tell Nisha all the time, we would always have police in the area. I do like that, too. Rather, I was just sitting there. She was like, man, they ain't never doing nothing. I said, I like that. I said, I love yeah. it. They're always in our neighborhood. I said, I love they're it. Good. I said, they, I don't they patrol never, through ours, too, a lot. I don't never get mad at that because when your record and stuff is clean, yeah. you don't have that nervousness. Of yeah, like, man, just, yeah. But I'd be like, yeah, cool. Appreciate you because I'm Absolutely. glad I see you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, whenever there's a... The, it's less likely. Yeah, it's not that it's not gonna happen. Yeah, but it's, it's less likely, likely for yeah. things to go on. Especially after that kid on my street. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh, they roam lo- even more. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with it. But shit, that's what you pay, man. You paying enough for these Hell areas? Yeah. yeah. The taxes over there. Yeah, all that. Should be able to have some nice, you know, recovery. Yeah. I mean, some protection. You know what I'm saying? But just be careful about that, man, because we just know how it is, you know. And don't put the big screen TV box by the dumpster. And just get this shit. Rip the box up. Yeah, rip then, that. Yeah, rip it up, bro. If you got to, or try to get it, you know. Mm-hmm. We used to do all kind of stuff. Oh man. man, my dad used to be like, "Nah, nah, nah, tear it up." Yeah, tear yeah. it up. <laughs> or when we used to go out of town, we, we end up using it. We wouldn't pack the car until at nighttime. Yeah. So people wouldn't know that, we was leaving. Keep the lights on. Certain the lights yeah, on. Like, mm-hmm. We was man. Hey, we had all you the. Do all you though. can to protect what you've worked for. Absolutely. Because <clears throat> other people, and just don't be one of them ignorant fools out there. Because nowadays, especially in Texas. A lot of people carry. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, don't it's, it's end a state your, where you can no, carry, so everybody's carrying. Yeah, uh, yeah. It ain't a chance that you'll probably make it just from a petty crime that you're trying to, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? So because everybody not watch the news and they're on edge. You know, mm-hmm. there are there is I feel like there is way more good going on than bad, but of course the bad is gonna be magnified times ten. For sure. So everybody is already gonna be on edge. No, everybody is not being watched. No, everybody is not a target. But for those that are it makes everybody else a little weary. So it, it will make you kind of like hesitant. And it's always like this during the holidays. Yeah. So yeah, I just yeah. ask so you just to be watch careful. Out. Watch out. You know, watch your surroundings at all mm-hmm. times. Just make sure you, you know, just be watch what's the smart. Just be smart. For sure. But yeah, um, 97, we need a title. Probably could do that after. But um, <laughs> yeah. yeah, other than that, Appreciate the pod, man. This is a good one, We man. had some other topics we were supposed to get on, but you know what? I love just kicking it on here and vibing out. Yeah, for um, sure. But next time, we definitely got to... <laughs> Tap in on some uh, oh, yeah. some trials that no. happen in one day. Some settlements. Yeah. Yeah, some, some <laughs> settlements. Yeah. It's a that. lot. It's a lot. It's a lot going oh, they're on. They're talking too much again. For all the they're dogs for real. Again. <laughs> <laughs> they're talking too much again. Yeah. But no, man. We love you guys, man. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the podcast. Episode 97. Make sure you share, like, all that good stuff. Subscribe. Yes, sir. We got this thing. Peace. Peace. This is the Hot Podcast, man.